Hello, hello. I am ready for battle. So yeah, who won? Oh, let's do. Alnarius shields the righteous in the pitiless cold. I reign. Uh, I believe it should be. Uh, like that. Uh, let me double check. Doom, doom, doom. Where is it? Yeah, 12, 13. That should be correct. Ish. I mean, what's the worst that can happen, right? Correct. Let's pick a portrait that looks like not that bad. Good enough. Doesn't actually matter. Obviously, max out the difficulty. Speak your mind. Oh, that's all right. mostly fine no additional party members now yeah we will have to enable it otherwise the uh, tooltips uh, will be way too annoying the game does not yet have a way to disable tutorial for good so enabling main quest guidance is oh, kind of the best uh, thing to disable it. And more to the point, why must I... Right. Ah, right. Yep. I come fetch you for every little thing. Yeah, we will be on our way. There is nothing crucial to do outside, so let's go in. I mean, I don't believe they've added anything here. Uh, let me open the dashboards real fast. I completely forgot to do that.
Uh, maybe. I mean, we'll hear these spells real soon. If you insist. and run no yeah uh, that will do I actually never paid attention uh, I believe Q is the first mode yeah Will take me a hot second to get used to the controls again. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess the UI is very similar to Pillars. The game itself probably not so much. So to get it out of out of the way, uh, we will be playing uh, solo. We are allowed to get companions uh, to pass skill out of combat skill checks. We are not allowed to fight with uh, any companions except for one we get for one fight in the story, uh, where it's unavoidable. And it would be just annoying to do otherwise. So, those are the rules, pretty simple. Who needs what? Uh, did I miss something? No? Hmm. Shouldn't it be here? That's weird. Hello. Huh. Ah, there we go. So Walcroft and Laurenthal want wine. So tiresome. Oh, the star. <laughs> Hello. Yes, yes, get on by. Yes, so next. Lord Joran won't sail. Well? Do you need something? And you those here. two won't oh. need. Ugh, the carriage just. Shh. 
Shall we do business, gentlemen? Gentle ladies? Yes, let's. We are convened to yeah, we'll skip it. Uh, <laughs> basically, what <laughs> happens you here uh, is Darren there on gold. While sitting at my table, uh, is rebelling. Now. It's a major well, kind of producer state. They have a mine and industry and whatnot. Uh, they are rebelling against hmm, unfair uh, taxation, which I can get behind. Uh, but that's basically what happens, and they are discussing here what they should do with it. Indeed. And then the mansion suddenly gets attacked by surprise, surprise, it's a big bad guy. My ladies, my lords, we are under Who attack. turns out to be Please, our soon to be no brother. Come. Yes, you come. Uh, the major Simon plot point you, is the world is cursed by greed, and world's greed becomes larger and larger, and you. with all the adverse effects. Like, people do fucked up shit because they're greedy and all that sort of deal. And it's up to us to deal or not with it. Our current goal, however, is to just survive and whatnot. Look in the eyes as you perish. Yeah, not to die for life. Like that. It generally does not matter at all what we do here, so long as we don't die miserably. The game does sort of support the active dodge, so if you are physically out of reach of enemies, you will not be attacked. So, kiting melee is very much a valid strategy here. And yeah, we would prefer to uh, be able to kill a few people, but it was not the case, so... Nothing really terrible happens from it. Watch your... Oh, we tried. get any XP here. Unfortunate but now listen to me. not too bad. Listen closely. This is important. You were never God stand this Darren Gold swine. And then we pass out because reasons. Which are by the way not explained anywhere in the game after the... Uh, well, after the fact. Basically, we never learned really who the witch is or anything of sorts. Found you at last, father. And here is our ill-fated brother. Don't worry, my child. Your hardships uh, yeah. are over for update. today. Uh, what happened is they made charisma slightly more useful.
which is, I mean, it's all right. It won't suddenly make anyone max out charisma, but it's a nice bonus, I guess. Especially for people He's like us who boy. are paladins and are forced into a bit of charisma anyway. Some other changes include rebalancing of the armor, in which way I have no idea yet, but I mean, it, it did happen there, so... Yeah, we have no regular spells, just the weighted ones for now. Wake up, lazy. Always sleeping, this one. Must have been raised by... Now, how about you make your... Take a... On the move. Yep, read ingredient Sp list. Oh, Put on the gauntlets. I Done. Do your bidding this time. And now we're ready to go outside and fight some spooders and whatnot. If you insist. Yes. Hello. Uh, but not before we sort stuff by weight and drop everything we don't absolutely have to have for now. Our main goal for now is to level as fast as humanly possible. Uh, which will happen once we clear all these. Uh... Look into my eyes as you perish. Uh, jungle, whatever it is. Uh... Yeah. Oops. On the move. That's unfortunate. Took a bit of a hit. It needn't happen. So yeah, the weapons do have cooldowns and we can easily exploit it by running away from especially melee enemies. We don't want to be hit, we are really squishy. We are pretty lucky with the hit rate. Uh, we should have around 50% because it's... Uh, cataclysm or whatever it's called, so... It's a higher difficulty, everything is dodgy as you can see. Basically we have around 50-50 to attack, well, to hit. I do your bidding this time. Blood and souls. As you can see, we are struggling to hit that spooder. We totally will try to exterminate all the local wildlife. To the every last one bit of them. Ah yeah, forgot to talk about the RPG system, it's uh, basically here is the only really important stat in the game, and that is physique, uh, because it determines how much HP you have, and the more HP you have, obviously, the less of a chance of you miserably dying like a complete idiot, and cutting your Travel loose uh, stats are capped at 20, which is where we are hoping to get with our physique and everything else. I mean, it would be nice if it happens. Hey, Rogan.
I mean, it is true though. Not dying is a very important part of any game. Dying is overall bad. You generally should try to avoid it as best you can. Ah, surrounded by curse. Oh yeah, and the rest. Uh, then dexterity is aim and accuracy. Primarily, aim and accuracy is the second most important stat because hitting enemies is almost as important as not dying. And on cataclysm stuff has a lot of dodge evasion, so uh, it's best to patch up your aim and accuracy through various means. Intelligence is solely for casters, we will need all those slots in eventually, which is why we are uh, investing a lot into intelligence. Uh, focus is uh, very important uh, since the patch, because everything interrupts you even harder than it did, and it did interrupt you pretty hard, and focus kind of protects against, against it, but we cannot afford to invest a lot into it, so it's... Eh, whatever. Uh, charisma now affects interrupts a lot, uh, and uh, we probably will try to get at least some of it through the gear, maybe, and we'll see. Uh, and Supernatural, it's mainly additional slots, and uh, Poison Resistance is the only one that actually matters, along with Heat uh, to a lesser extent, uh, but Poison and Acid is the most common uh, elemental damage type in the game, so... so Hell, take the hindmost! Well, I mean, what can you do if it's true? And we are continuing to kite some spooders around. Main reason is not only they will try and probably succeed in stun locking us if we just stand there, they also have high rate of attack and then... They do poison us, and poison at this point of the game will probably take out pretty much all of our HP, which we do want to try and avoid. If you insist. Poison is pretty bad die, at this point. Die, die, I mean, our 20%. Surrounded by uh, here goes the poison. Uh, we will have to chug a potion, probably. As it will do a lot of damage to us. But we obviously will let it tick out first. We have nothing in the way of armor at this point, and screen shakes are crits, which don't really matter. Not at this point, they will eventually, but not right now. There we go. Yes, uh, now keep the antidote. And here goes the level up. We'll increase our talking abilities for the sole reason of playing solo, otherwise someone else can take it. Uh, here, I mean, uh, challenging how is completely useless to us. Uh, shattering shot is alright, but eh, I mean, it's ranged. And we will not do ranged for quite some time, and even if we do, it will not come into play at all. Waylay is alright for bludgeoning, completely useless for everything else. So we continue stacking some vi vigilance, which is very much useful, it increases our basic stats, like game evasion dodge, that sort of deal. So 
so we are done with this part of the area let's go clear the remainder I mean XP is XP and killing defenseless wildlife is way better than some aggressive goblins and whatnot. For now our spell selection is very limited, we need to level up a bit for it not to be the case. On the move. Look into my eyes as you perish. Well, we are really struggling to hit that spooder. At least it's not aggressive. Very nice, we managed to kill one of them before they turned aggressive. Oops. No, 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 no. Stop that. Uh, we probably are better served. To drink a potion. So I mean, they are not expensive and it die, generally die, die. will prevent the load, potentially. I'd prefer not to save scum if I can help it. the local Zombo man. Whom we kill with the help of our vigilance. Uh, those guys are surprisingly dodgy. In the beginning at least. And we'll cut through the edge of the map. Onto the other side. If you As you do. Do not waste my time. And so we return to the old lady. Probably needn't to rest, but if you insist. it was safety. Feel well, needn't to, to drink a potion. If you need. Yeah, here is the drying stuff. I mean, we uh, could come a few things out of her, but then... Again, ah, load. So, some powders and on the all right. Talking, yes. So she explains about greed and how it works, basically the more you greed, uh, the more world greed uh, grows and it will grow slowly by itself, just not as much as with your help. Uh, greed is generally pretty bad because greed item is way worse uh, than non-greed item. If you stay at zero greed you, get, you can use moonlight earrings, uh, which are grossly overpowered. 
unless uh, devs changed it. Yeah, no, I can't report to. Uh, she will uh, teach us a basic spell, which is completely and utterly useless. But I mean, it's better than nothing, so we will slot it for now. I do your bidding this time. Yes, very good. Uh, she teaches us to disable traps of magical variety, which pretty much all of them are. With kinda rare exceptions, but generally they are all magical. Uh, it's the only time in the game when we will actually disable them. And here is the actual useful ability, uh, namely forcing locks. Forcing locks is very good. Feeling well. Speak your mind. Yes, I know. Uh, namely because of the formula for forcing locks. It's an amazing one-pointer, which all warrior classes get by default. Uh, here... Uh, where is it? It should be here, right? Force locks and doors, there you go. Basically, it grows very little uh, from the actual skill increase, but it gets a lot from your physique. As opposed to, say, lockpicking, which is mostly skill and then uh, stats are more supplementary. But yeah, it's very useful, it will allow us to open pretty much every meaningful container in the game, except for one. Don't you have enough so uh, Which is kind of the sole reason why we are even bringing any companions into the picture and why there is a caveat in my solo run. Feel free. All right, she wants us to rest again. Good morning. I feel th Yes, that is. Yep. And she tells us that Lord Espen was our father, and technically, if you insist, our, uh, the next big thing to do. Uh, by the way, why is my phone so big? Uh, let me change it to normal. Yeah, tooltips are kind of way too big. Can I shrink down the UI somehow? I guess not. Oh, all right. On the move. We'll have to deal with it. So yeah, uh, technically we should go to town and find some way uh, to get our stuff that belong to us by birthright. Spoiler alert, we are getting fuck all. I mean, what RPG would it be, right? If you are suddenly a noble and have lands and money and everything you wish at the start of the game, yeah, bad chance of that happening. Uh, 
Hello? But what Hello? might and will actually happen is we will get in trouble and all that. The king is also cursed by greed, which surely will not help us in our endeavors. Uh, did I get the boots? Yes, so mm. we can safely sell everything. Uh, magic staff we will keep for the sole reason of it increasing our stats, actually. Let's identify it for some more XP. On the moon. And now we can go uh, clear out the area some Look at my eyes as you perish. for exactly the same reason. It's more XP, we need level 4 as soon as possible. Preferably sooner. Oh. Uh, animation cancelled by accident. Uh, basically the game is animation based, so if you don't let your sword thing finish, it will not go through. Yeah, but it will trigger the cooldown. Uh, abilities and attacks are on separate cooldowns. So you can give in any ability, inclu including a spell, into your attack pattern. Which is why some weapon skill is important for pretty much everyone. Well, maybe not for pure mages, but we are not that. And in general, playing a pure mage is bad mojo. Speak your mind. It will not go over well for you. As those are squishy. And being squishy is pretty bad. If I recall correctly, uh, we should get fangs here despite getting level 2 spells. Uh, we will soon visit the royal library and rob it a little. But not right now. Yes, cut all of that garbage. Well, most of that garbage that is. Yes, I know. Hello, Dogo. I know you have friends out there, so don't you dare. I mean, yeah, here are Doggo's friends. And here goes the interrupt, which is the major annoying point of the game. Interrupts are plentiful and annoying, and we will not be able to resist them in the foreseeable future, which is a major source of randomness in the early game. There is nothing we can do about it. And since we are uh, emoticalized with the Paladin, despite not yet getting Paladin spells for level 1, uh, we got Hand of Mercy, which we will merely slot. 
let's make it a tad more tidy and easier to read. That's kind of better. I say we do that. Yeah, three and five is a decent distribution. Yes, I know. Die, die, die. Uh, they are, by the way, all healing spells because uh, Predator Fangs uh, heals us for a lot on hit. And it does not expire on attack if memory serves well until you hit. So if you miss, nothing happens. And it delivers through a weapon attack so you can think of like Magus. Same deal except it actually works with any weapon. Well, the world goes to shit pretty much in uh, any uh, type of the scenario, but it will go to a lot more shit if you are greedy, yes. Uh, you basically are a catalyst to the world and will push it uh, further into greed curse. my eyes as you perish. So, behaving altruistically, refusing rewards, helping the needy, all that sort of deal, uh, will delay uh, the curse effects. Uh, main thing the curse effects is um, how NPCs behave, the NPCs will be more greedy, the world is more greedy, so they will offer less rewards and uh, sometimes they will outright attack you. Uh, yeah, I've done uh, a run before, but that was on pretty much release patch, and the game was patched a bunch since then. I also moved it uh, to a like 5 gig uh, read uh, NVMe, so hopefully it helps loading screen screens at least a bit uh, since last time. If that doesn't do it, I don't know what will. On the move. Yeah, no opportunity attacks. Uh, but generally the combat system is not too bad, you gotta pay attention, fight and do all that sort of deal. Uh, let's save and rest. Well, we even were not attacked. And we'll keep that wolf alive, if I recall correctly, it does increase random encounter chance. Seven enemies. Ah, I triggered it. Well, that's alright. So yeah, uh, my plan is to grind up to level 4, I believe, where we will get our Paladin spells and then we'll continue more or less normally. I will not grind a lot. Uh, the time does not really exist apart from I do your set intervals. Surrounded by shares. Here, take the high boost. <laughs> Yeah, 
yeah, we are getting heavily interrupted. I guess we can just fight. So yeah, Mage's life is not easy in the beginning. What can you do? Oh yeah, uh, that happened a lot there. On to Rothgore with you. Healed and healed. Hopefully there will not be a lot of uh... if you insist. Oh, well, that's pretty bad. Die, die, die! Oh. Surrounded by Get lost. Oh, my mouth died. I'm like, why is it not going as planned? My mouse was dying. To with you. Oh, really? They managed to interrupt us still. Oh, that's unfortunate. There we go. Quarter of the way there. Uh, it's a spell. We've chosen it on level up. Our first level up, well, as a character creation, uh, we've joined to the elevated spell, uh, which is that one. It's a pretty good one. Uh, and at, at the second level up we picked up Predator Fangs, uh, we uh, do have second level slots, but we have no second level spells just yet. Oh, come on. Fight me, game. There we go. That's a nice encounter. I'll cut you to little pieces. Oh yeah, uh, very nice, it's reasonably juicy in terms of experience and even better in terms of getting some loot out of it. So yeah, basically these um, are obviously the spells and here is uh, fighter special abilities, I guess. They are shared among pretty much every fighter in the game. Uh, the only difference is Paladins do not get Berserk of one of their options uh, and Highlanders, which are local Berserkers, don't get uh, Vigilance. That's pretty much it. Uh, but <sighs> Paladins do have Paladin spells, which makes Paladin kind of fighter-caster hybrid. And by combining uh, Paladin with a Mage, we do get... Uh, 
arcane spells and paladin spells combined, which uh, form a Hello? very balanced attack and defense spellbook, which is what we are after. Uh, I mean, it is kinda reminiscent of the second edition D&D, I guess, games, something like Baldur's Gate and stuff. That would be closer than everything. That is kind of good and bad at the same time. Uh, the good part is, I mean, it's familiar, you know. Uh, the bad part, uh, well, the obvious bad part is it's a bit iffy at times. Oh, uh, we didn't identify the Gambeson. That's XP we are missing. Hmm. So let's identify before selling it. Buckler we can sell as well. Don't need the dagger. I blame the king. Yeah, and let's sell that. Plus one focus, plus two focus, so we can safely sell this one, I believe. Unless we will ever need learning and research buff. Uh, Steve, uh, staves as is customary, there are magic uh, staves and then there are uh, combat staves. Combat staves are some of the best weapons in the game, but we will not be using oh. those, probably. Uh, maybe I'll spec into them, but there is fat chance we are actually using them. Uh, we will uh, mostly use long blades, which consist of two-handed swords uh, and one-handed as they are dubiously called in pretty much every game ever. Long sword, which is not correct, but whatever. Uh, basically, Don't we get arming swords awesome. and two-handed swords. Surprisingly enough, they are very slow, but it's not attack which we are after. Uh, what we are looking for is one particular uh, long sword. Oh, what an asshole. Well, Battle Brothers, yeah, uh, but even their uh, two-handed weapons are weird. I mean, most are fine, but uh, hammers are very weird. Except for fall hammers, those are actually real. But yeah, uh, the close combat two-handed hammers are very iffy. I mean, who the fuck goes to combat with Sledge? But, I mean, yeah. Ah, surrounded by curse. Look into my eyes as you perish. To Rothgore with you. Hey, murder. I do your bit. Very nice. Time. Sadly, we will not get, get more XP for identifying stuff we've already identified, so... 
Ah. Here is the. A uh, part where we actually can die. Come on, don't get stuck. Get them stuck if you can. Unlucky. They always manage to hit us. Let's try the other three. There we go. Don't get hit, please. Let's run him back to the trader dude. He will fight for us. We need like two seconds. There we go. That should work. Yep. The dude did not fight for us, but it's alright. He usually does attack. Uh, they probably changed it at some point. Nice. Restored to full. bit of a cough. Hope I muted in time. Hello. Yeah, uh, he usually did get an... and fought for us, but apparently not anymore. Oh, no big deal. What is important is we didn't die, and our cash stack kinda grows slowly, so we'll be able to afford some actual armor once we get to town, which will be in very short amount of time. Uh, we just need to finish our level. It's important to survive and not die as a solo. So. Come on, fight me game. And yeah, the time doesn't really exist as is customary for most games. So we can just skip time, it doesn't absolutely matter at all. Look at that. Surrounded by curse. I know. To war with you. Surrounded by curves. Oh, fine, I'll kill you the old fashioned way. There we go. That's fine. So, uh, with increased interrupts, uh, early game is a bit scrappier than it used to be, but we will persevere. I will get better at manipulating 
enemy's actions, so it will be fine overall. Hopefully. Oh, so tiresome. Oh, that's actually bad. We are probably dead. Yeah, uh, my main hope there was so they miss and we could heal. I'm not sure where we got so damaged, they probably crit us or something. I'm too lazy to check the log. But we've lost all of our HP. And yeah, interrupts on Cataclysm are very cancelled. What can you do? Yeah, it was a clean hit. Well, that was very hopeful from me. Surrounded by curs. Oh, come on. Hit him. Thank you. started when I moved. That's so annoying. At least they give decent amount of XP for it, so that's nice. Oh, yeah, let's save so we won't have to replay it. Like my only goal here is... Ah, surrounded by curse. I mean, the interrupt stuff will get better as we get blocking and whatnot. Uh, what? That's a new one. Yeah. We used to be able to force random encounters instead, but 
I believe the devs still didn't re-enable it, since it was causing very severe memory leaks. I'm pretty sure they removed it and never added it back, so no random encounters these days. Well, on the open map that is. Come on, game. You can do it. One more counter, please. Very nice. time now. Ah, tell me I will get up in time. Nope. That was way longer knockdown that we can land on enemies ever. Enemies are always down for like three seconds. Um, I, however, was down for <laughs> like six, I believe, at least. They both attacked twice, so yeah, six or more. If oh, that higher difficulty variance for the early game. Look into my eyes as you perish. We are naturally not very dodgy in the early game. Blood oh. to Roth Gore with you. Uh-huh. That's what killed us last time. Speak your mind. I do your bidding this time. For you, he still shoots us. Hmm. They usually switch when you threaten them. Or I guess he could have critted us again. Well, it's as per usual when we need, like, one decent encounter. The game will give you a middle finger. Surrounded by curses. Look into my eyes as you perish. No, that looks okay. Nope, Surrounded not okay. Hitting on me. There we go, here is our level up.
There we go. Now just to sell and off we go. No more random encounters. Well, except the ones we spawn on accident. Speak your mind. Oh, uh, max skill level is 15, by the way. I do your bidding this time. And now we have some big big spells from a pally boy. Still no second level ones, but that will be fixed Hello? in a short while. Let's sell the garbage for the last time. don't need no to that nope, nope. that can go nice yeah off we go I know. sadly uh fighter mage types only have access to the medium armor which is unfortunate but nothing can we do about it if you insist it doesn't matter what you answer here they will get you through anyway. They don't care really. There is a group of adventurers outside the city. We will mug them shortly. Oh, I actually don't remember if I arrested. Not that we will need it, I don't think. If you insist. Yeah, let's fight him. There goes one. Yeah, I didn't trust him. Surrounded by some. And we lost one. We don't even need to move. We'll just kill him. They are probably the weakest enemies in the game. It's just a scripted fight. No big deal at all. I like to use those three barrels as storage, so that we will do. We'll sort everything by weight and we'll drop off. All the plant based stuff we will not feasibly need. Um. Because crafting potions and whatnot is positively useless in this game. Assist. And now here are a lot of closed chests. Uh, basically, every NPC will warn you once about doing something they don't like and after that they will attack but like we kick in the lock we go outside we get back in and what do you if know you they completely forgot about everything that happened and will try to warn you again and so you can rob literally everyone If you and I'm pretty damn sure it's the intended way. 
uh, because otherwise thieving would not even exist in this game because enemies often see through if stealth and whatnot. So you might as well pick uh, pick that lock and be stealthy and all that. He will still react the same. So yeah, do that. That's how the game is supposed to do. Uh, you can also save load but to much the same effect. If you insist. But changing locations Speak your is mind. faster. If you insist. I'm pretty sure that everything that we cared about got the gauntlets out of it, everything else is whatever. Everything that we don't absolutely have to have. There we go. That should be sufficient, don't need that either. Armor-wise, he has plate which we can't wear, sadly. So, he doesn't have anything we are interested in here, uh, what he does have is, uh, I believe, that one, and plate gauntlets, which are marginally better. That will do for now. Immediately sell everything we don't need, as you do. That should do it, weapon-wise. I don't believe we need anything from him. Uh, what's that? That's new. Oh. Oh. That's actually very poker shield. We'll buy it, but just not right now. Right now we have other expenses to take care of, but I will remember about it. Anything else changed? Let's see... No... That's one of the better uh, hammers in the game. It has slight damage increase, but hammers are very slow. Like if you can look at attack time, hammers are only 0.5 faster than great swords. The obvious upside is they are uh, one-handed, but hey, I mean. But well, that's very cool. On the move. Anyway, um, let's go get our insist. early game armor first.
Well, generally there are a few things we need to get around town. No biggie, it's actually good that we arrived at night, so we have the whole day to go shopping. Can I help you? Greetings. Yes, we... Hmm? Yeah, uh, we do need his stock. I mean, I would prefer to get a discount first, but we can't really afford to do that, we need gear. So those rings got nerfed a bit, I believe they were 5% previously, uh, but still, 5 to dodge and block alone are kinda worth it. That ring will increase our longevity by quite a bit. So that's our next stop. Speaking Don't you have another Lex if you Come on. insist? Oh. If you insist. That lady wouldn't at all mind if we help ourselves to her belongings so long as we revisit her shop often. Yeah, that's exactly what happens. If you insist. Basically, they all have Alzheimer's or something like that. If you insist. I'm actually not sure which one would be better. But hey. Yes. Yep. Uh, get another quest. Can I help you? But before uh, that, let's see what she has. Earrings. Hmm, I mean, not for the long term, but there is a world where we are buying it. I'll think on it. In either case, the answer would be not quite yet. I'll keep the gloves though, uh, we'll see our end game gear uh, later, if you but I will sure keep them in case we need them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same deal. If you insist. If you insist. And here are our alchemist gloves, that's the thing we are actually using. Unless it was nerfed into the ground, which it might be. Nah, no, they still awesome. So, we are wearing those. No doubt in my mind. So, our resistances are still kinda shite, but not as if shite as they were a second ago. Yeah, yeah, stop it right now, that we will. If you she will give us another quest to dealies. Yes. Yes. 
Let's see the wares. Uh, Entango is not accessible. That's way too expensive, even if we they wanted to use it. Ah, yeah, they've added cases for the potions and herbs, I'm pretty sure. But there isn't we anything we actually want. What's that? I don't remember Potion of Shade at all. It's cooling. Uh, I believe it's heat resistance. I mean, the game could uh, could have done better with descriptions, but whatever. If you insist. Yeah, we'll yank that. We'll scribe it, obviously, immediately. I believe it's like level... 3 or 4 spell. No? Higher. Oh, level 5 spell. Holy hell. Well, anyway. If you insist. Anything I need to expropriate. Come on, move. Welcome to Isselbride. Thank you. No, nothing here. Nothing here, and yeah, don't need that. Alrighty. Let's um, go to the next one in line. You insist. Yes. I don't care about that. If you insist. Not really. I mean, I'll probably never bother with if you crafting insist. anything. Yeah, they are not too happy about me if you insist. yanking that, but there is absolutely nothing they can do about it, so... They'll have to deal with it. And we are going in that. It's more level 1 slots for us. Very nice. I will actively avoid that encounter for now. If you insist. Life is so oh, my dude. The price is so high. Yeah, we'll do Long what we can. King. Ah, it's so annoying this piece of shit tooltip. Uh, is there any way to disable it? I mean, not that I know of, but hey. Maybe it's like... Nope. There is no way to disable that shit. I believe there was a key to hide the uh, to hide the UI. 
Maybe that will help. that I can still remember. Well, let's try to be quick with our fingers. Can I help you? There we go. Thanks for the follow, Hendrakon. Or Hendrakon. Whichever it is, welcome. Yep, items. Anything you have that we might use. Uh, I don't believe so, but we'll check. Yeah, that's all a bit out of our budget. The game, I mean, it's alright, it will not break any records in terms of pretty much anything, really, but it's alright. If you have nothing to play, it will serve you just fine. If you insist. It's average in about every way possible, it, it's just fine. The writing is not too terrible, the mechanics are alright-ish, uh, the game is reasonably entertaining, there is at least two playthroughs in the game, uh, with greed and without greed. So, you probably will eventually get your money's worth out of it. So yeah, it basically uh, sums up to, uh, did you play every other major RPG, so say if you have a choice between this and say Under Rail, they are not comparable in quality or quantity, to be fair. If you insist. So yeah, it also makes for a decent vacation game to take with you uh, on a laptop, for example, and spend a few evenings with it. Granted, you probably will not finish it in a few evenings, the game is not that short. You don't... But yeah. Overall, I can recommend it with a few caveats. On the move. So let's go get our early game armor, it will serve us decently. Can I help you? Yep, show me what you have, give me that. Anything else? Yes, ring of lies, and we will take it. Don't believe we need anything else here. Let's sell a new armory bits. Greetings. And we can sell that. And that back to him. Don't need it. That should do it. If you insist. So that armor is decent. Gets us some resistances and whatnot. 
if you insist. Let's gain a bit more XP while we are here. If you insist. Yep, yep, yep. Yes. Yeah, give the noble his bracer back. Can I help you? It's nothing much. And we can rest while at it. If you insist. So it's night time, we can go clear this. After we quick save, because reasons. I mean, after the patch, I'm not. 100% confident in our abilities to do that. We'll see. Yep, yep, yep. Look into my eyes as you perish, ah, surrounded by curse. How to wrath go with you? On the annoy them a little. Ah, surrounded by curse. Awesome. How? So the problematic part is done. Now it's so just like tightening. <laughs> By us, truly indeed. I She's happy. We are happy. This time, yeah, everyone is. I probably should have taken the. Grave digger quest before uh, going here, but it's all right. We'll return here later. At the moment, we are done with the place. Let's go find stuff elsewhere. Still not sure. Yeah. There, I we are done with tutorial. Holy shit, it's annoying. Anyway, uh, while we are waiting for the next day. We can go kill some zombos, I guess. 
another option is to go to the yeah let's go to the warden hub maybe uh we will be allowed in i'm not actually sure if we are now uh, without the certain companion granted uh by the rules of my solo run we are allowed to take companions just not for the combat encounters So if we are barred entrance, if you insist. we can always go and grab her. Granted that getting companions early is not good mojo as they only level up to your level when you get them not at any time after that which means the later you get them the better even in your normal run if you insist thanks for the information uh, let's try to roll in as a student, I guess. Uh, hell if I remember who we need to talk to about it. Yeah, we can yoink a few goodies. Can I help you? I will not bother stealing anything we don't need. It's more effort than I'm willing to. Speak your mind. On the move. But we got another focus bracer, which will serve us decently well. The more focus we get, the harder we are to interrupt. For now those bracers will do nicely. If you insist. Hello, sir. Yeah, he really doesn't want to enroll us, does he? don't like us doing that so we'll have to change locations before robbing them blind every time if you insist yeah yeah stop right now uh, that we will not if you insist If you insist. So that our snow. It's a decent first level range spell, but we probably will never use it. Although we'll see. Actually, we. Oh, let's do that. That looks slightly better. If you insist. Anything else left on the shelves? They might or might not have rebalanced stuff, so let's see. Summon Wolf. I don't care about that one. Same with Pudra summoning.
Oh uh, yeah, I'll join that. Generally our job here is to get as many spells here as we physically can. If you insist. Which is my only concern with the access to the library as there is a spark growing there. I don't care. Uh, yes, thank you. I'll take that. It's not the best thing ever, but I mean, it's a mobility spell if you insist. of moderate utility. No, don't care. Same deal. Let's break the container, see what's inside. I don't believe there is anything there, at least it wasn't the case on the previous patches, but we'll see nonetheless. Insist. A potion of healing, huh? We'll see about us yoinking that. Here comes the guard. If you insist. Ah. Yeah, right. We'll take all of that. That will be our secondary slot for now. If you insist. Let's go sell our Hello? garbage. In the meantime, we'll check if he has anything. Yeah, they actually added a bunch. Celestial barrage. I don't even remember this one. It's an elevated 7th level spell for Spellweaver of Intermage and Necromancer, so actually Necros now have a usable 7th level spells, that's actually cool. Bottomless bag, that's nice. Fireballs, Gale Shroud, that's I will test it in not too long. Great Glacial Rush, that's for Winter Mage. We are ways away from it though. Bunch of summons. Container for scrolls, all that. Cool. everything we don't have to have. Wool pine threads we will keep. Anything else? Yeah, they've made scrolls considerably more costly.
Alrighty. Let's remember about the chain lightning and barrage, we'll see. About buying those, not right now at least. Same for Gale Shroud and Glacial Rush. But they are slightly too high level for us right now. So we will not bother. At least we get right the lightning for the second level. I mean, it's not anything I'm excited for, but it's alright, that'll do. Hmm. I blame the So is there any way outside of actually doing the companion quest to get there? I wonder. I mean I know the easy way. If you insist. Let's see any named ones now. Can I help you? Anything interesting also now. That's fine by me. I guess we'll have if to go the Annoying way around it. What's that? Ah, yeah, just some random stuff. Don't believe there is anything useful there, is it? Nope. Nothing we care about. Speak your mind. On the move. Fine by me. If you insist. I believe there is a dude. Yeah. Speak your mind. Yes, hello. On the move. Yep. Got the quest ideally. Anything we should yoink here, maybe like that. Still looking for what he's requested, that's so fine. I do your bidding this time. So yeah, I guess the only way to enlist is to actually go with the quest. For the what's he, uh, her name? Biala. That if one you insist. Well, I 
guess we will do that. Very much annoying. I thought they died the way, but either we have to do the quest for this dude first, which will not be simple as he wants some living bark if memory serves. Let's see. Voice in the woods. If All right. Insist. Maybe actually after giving him that book, he'll give us access. That would be very nice. Anywho, uh, let's go kill some... Ghouls and whatnot. Do the quest. If you insist. Hello. Oh, legs. Stidons. To rough go with you. Really? Look into my Interrupt. eyes as you perish. Of all things. To rough go with you. Don't you dare. Thanks for the heal. Surrounded by curses. Leave Britney alone. Is with armor these days. Yeah, that's a far cry from a hundred. That's slightly better. Yes, I know.
Finally, we can move freely. That was a minimal damage. Yeah. Oh, that's very bad. No good. Let's I guess chug a potion if we can. Fine. Well, that happens sometimes. Yeah, the new interrupt system I really don't like. I mean, one would guess that enemies should... N well, like, ghouls should not have a billion charisma. But apparently they do. If you insist... Well, yeah, pretty much everything apparently is very sexy. Since everything has pretty much a 100% chance to interrupt. And mind you, we did increase our focus some, so... We are at 9 at the moment. Uh, yeah, interrupt uh, chance and strength, and focus increases interrupt chance. Look into my eyes as you get <laughs> surrounded by curse. by curse. Ninja ghouls. What are you gonna do about that? I do go fitting this time. Hmm. 
<laughs> yeah. That gets me turned on already. Yeah, surrounded by cares. Also, a tiny spider carries a sword. Yes, you do. I like how they are called stray ghouls. As in their uh, domesticated ones. Oh, come on, stop blocking. And also obey my commands, please. Don't eat the input. And let's see if we are dead from the knockdown. Nope, not quite dead. Oh, that was a nice creep. Hell, take the 
There we go. That would be called a success. can finish that quest or yeah let's go murder some adventurers i hope they didn't change it to increase greed adventures are such a nice source of free gear that would be most unfortunate If you insist. So here is our prey, and that exact dude has the exact sword we wouldn't mind yoinking. Speak your m yes, I know. I'll cut you into little pieces. Even better, got a level out of it. So, 
I don't believe that one is sold anywhere. So we'll get that. I mean, it is sold, but it's way, way, way later in the game. So we can't afford to wait. Another thing that could be useful is to dust, but... Heat damage is not what we mostly do. So I say we grab that one. We are some ways away from the... Actual big dick paladin spell, but whatever. belong to us that's actually the earliest plate armor you can get for free if you can wear it which we absolutely cannot not at the moment well not on this character that is what we can do though is to join that one this blade is 3 to 10 and 1 to pulse and blow, so it's obviously better in every way possible and has some bonus accuracy and whatnot, so it's just better. Yes, I know. Free stuff. And now we can go and sell. So yeah, if you are playing a fighter type, or if you are playing with companion, that plate armor can actually be handy. Not for us. We absolutely do not care. Not in the slightest. We'll sell it. I do want to yank that shield though. If you insist. If you insist. Yeah. Hello. Would you be so kind? Their appears are absolutely horrible. They are slow, they do no damage. Not so sure what's so noble about it, but they can. They can have it, I don't care. So 
sell that as well, we don't need it. So, cash stack is not doing too hot still. We need like 10k overall, I would say. Somewhere in that ballpark. Side, don't need it. Where to now? Uh, let's. Um, I guess let's finish that one. That would be a quest done. If you insist. Can I help you? Greetings. Yes. can not accept the reward. Hmm? This one used to be usable, it was plus one strength, now it's of nothing, so we just finished that quest, it's whatever. If you insist. Well, since it's night time, it's not much we can do, so... Let's go on to further adventures, I guess. Maybe next time we are in the city, we'll do the city quests. There is quite some stuff to do. Hello. Yeah, yeah. He wants us to clear insist. the road. Yes. We'll do. Look into my eyes as you perish. That was very bad, no good. Ah, surrounded by curse. For real. Thank you. Come on. Blood Make your cells. animation. Oh. 
Nice, got dropped a bit, but that's okay. I do your bidding this time. I'll cut you to little pieces. Can I help you? Yeah. Let's bone craft a quest. absolutely no way we can heal oh unfortunate we were interrupted way too much Well, we, if we, I mean, it should get better as we yoink more focus from all over the place. Problem is, at the moment, we don't have a lot in the way of focus gear. If you insist, oh, we'll have to redo that area. Ah, eh, whatever. It's all right, I guess. Hello. If you insist, look into my eyes as you perish. Do 
I'll cut you to little pieces. Poison. To Rothgor with you. Yes, I know. Can I help you? I would prefer to be slightly higher level so we do have at least a bit of bow but that didn't happen so let's hope that it doesn't take forever they are generally not too dodgy And those snacks are the only reason you should keep a bow. I'm not even sure we'll level the bow this time around. I might go for staves. Yes. I'll cut you into little pieces. Yes, I know. Oh, that's a big drop there. It will take a bit of time. Yeah, the game looks all right. It does have a pure vibe and all that sort of deal. But yeah, it's decently animated and all that. One less grub. Hell, take the hindmost. Ah, nice. We do have a shot here. Those snakes hurt like a... Well, they hurt real bad. 
so don't fight him if you can. So tiresome. At least not in any fair way. Luckily the range sucks, so they are pretty much free. So long as you pay attention. Yay! Speak your mind. There goes our level up. So we have our large blades. Let's go for I guess we can go for staves if we really wanted to. Sure. I mean, it really doesn't matter. Let's. Uh, what was it? Slow. I mean, whatever. Uh, let's get a few of those. I do your bidding this time. Yeah, come on, Mr. Skelly Boy. Don't be shy. Yeah, under AoE is very much worth it. Tyranny, I guess so to a lesser extent. Main problem with Tyranny being, I mean, the game has no ending. So if you don't mind hell of a cliffhanger, with no prospects of it ever continuing, then yeah. If you hate cliffhangers and unsolved uh, mysteries and all that, yeah, maybe that would not be your cup of tea. If you insist. Under rail, though, under rail is probably the best game of the decade. So yeah, grab that. That's a steal for sure, at any price really, and especially when discounted. Blood cells. Well, yeah, it is underappreciated. I mean, it stands to reason the game is not exactly inviting, should I say. On the move. I mean, it doesn't have the mass market appeal, that's for sure. And a lot of people will get shit stomped and at like Depot A. 
and drop the game forever. There is also that. Hell, take the hindmost. Well, that's not a good shit stomping. Basically, Depot A is an early game area that serves as a build filter. So if yes, your build is not adequate for the difficulty you are playing on, you will get your shit kicked in there. Pretty much that. Rudely. So tiresome. Uh, where is the part where we can circle around? There we go, that one. I do your bidding this time. Well, yeah. Um, there will be more, actually. It's just the start. I'll cut you to little pieces. eating so far as the area goes maybe there there are a few snakes left but that would be it even if that was the case and I'm pretty sure we are done with those either Yep, take care. Hello. 
yeah we'll take a look maybe there is something new here actually sure if Lamborghini is worth it. I mean it's alright but Captain's Longsword is not that much worse and I really want that shield so probably not. I do your bidding. Listen. And he gave us a sling or some shit. Yeah that thing. We won't sell it, not just yet. So this is done. Next order of business is getting that area done. If you insist. So let's wait. It's hour 22, so let's wait like 10 hours. We need it to be daytime. On the move. Mm. So we need to go to the Gravekeeper. I'm not sure if he's home at day or at night actually. Always forget. If yeah, daytime. So that will give us a combat if encounter at the graveyard right here at night. And let's yoink a quest. To collect some money to uh, for the local crime lord. If you insist. We will obviously do the if regular stuff. If you insist. And kick in some locks. The XP is not great for it, but the loot maybe is. I don't remember what's here. Yeah, that we don't care about. the quest the thingy if you insist oh there is also a chest right there I don't actually remember what's in it if but let's insist. kick it in nonetheless Yeah, what's that noise? All that. It's just your imagination, dude. 
if you insist. That will go into bargain and persuasion bin. If you insist. Can I help you? Yes, what do you have here? Uh, let's make sure we do know all of those before Greetings. selling them. That should do. Don't believe there is anything. Oops. Oh, that's my bad. I forgot I've already stolen. Well, anyway, there isn't anything useful there. Unless the dev said it's something, but I highly doubt it's anywhere in the beginning of the game. Oh, and the memory leak does catch up to us, actually. So it was not fully resolved. I mean, mind you, uh, saves and game are on different NVMEs. Uh, both are 4 gigabytes read and write, so yeah. Anyway, let's collect some stuffs. Here is. One, uh, oh, we failed. I actually thought we have enough, but all right. Let's get our gear on. And I will need to relaunch the game. So the loads are manageable again. If you insist. That should be all right. Hello. Yes, uh, got a pouch. Another one. Yes. And another one. And we do not lose reputation because we just persuade them. We don't intimidate or anything of sorts. So we are still good. Hello. And the last one.
And that's the quest to deal it on. He actually gives you a pretty decent mace if you are into those for this quest, but uh, we will refuse. Oh, if you insist. Uh, something is left. If you insist. We collected from everyone except for the... Ah, right, right, right. Ah, uh, one more. If you insist. I believe our duty is right here. If memory serves. I mean, it's been like half a year since I've played, so... When are we gonna get more rations? Yeah, there we go. What do you know? All those people actually had the cash on them. It turns out... If you insist. Ain't it always like that? You want a beating? It actually does decrease reputation, but not uh, the greed. Which is to say, reputation is completely useless. At least used to be. And I don't believe anything changed. If you insist. Speak your mind. Anyway, uh, we are not fighting them, so what are our options really? I mean, it's possible to refuse the quest, I guess. So here... We want Acid Drain and Icicle Lance. And how if I remember which we can get fast? I believe one of them is easily accessible from a scroll. Uh, let's go to the witch and look at her stock nowadays. If you insist. There might be new scrolls, maybe Acid Drain was removed from that. If I believe we can buy Acid Drain from her. Let's not level up just yet. If you insist. Hello. Hello. Yes, your wares. Yeah, here is the acid rain. Yeah, they really did increase the cost of stuff. Well, what are you gonna do? What's that? Oh, that's a reagent. All right. Oh, and she does have fangs, so we... Well, nowadays, so we didn't need to learn it. Oh, the more you know. Unfortunate. Well, anyways, uh, we will learn Acid Rain. Speak your mind. And that solidifies our next choice. Easily, as it's an icicle lens.
Very nice. Uh, we still have a long ways to go. That we already have, that we might actually yoink. We'll see about that. Get them. The nobles caused our problems. Hello. There we go. Yes. Uh, here is the maze we, uh, we've we gotten for it. I mean, it grants vengeful spirit once per day. This power is alright-ish. I mean, it's usable. Uh -uh. Where is the gear costing? There it is. So, yeah. It's an alright uh, spell, it's reasonably high level and all, but we do mm -hmm. need the cash and we don't need the mace. So, off it goes. I do your bidding this time. If you insist. Hmm. So what's next? I guess we can rest at the tavern. Granted, I can become reasonably rich pretty fast if I get our thief, uh, well, uh, get the thief into the party and start stealing stuff. By the way, it's easy to miss, but every tavern actually does have a stock. Mm -hmm. So you want to ask for a room and then switch out here and click on, on to all to see everything. I mean, this one doesn't sell anything in particular, but some do, so it doesn't hurt to check. Why aren't we resting? I should get back to my Well, fine, I'll go to the other tavern. Whatever game. I'm not sure if what's insist. happening there. So kind. Hmm. Greetings. And this one doesn't want to rest us either. Hmm? Yes, I want a basic room. No? Uh, let me relaunch the game. See if that fixes it. Well, first, uh, it will help us to deal with the memory leak. Let me see if it's capturing. 
Yep. I mean, it's Can way I... better than it used to be with this game. Yep. And tavern resting now works. And by the way, yeah, here is this tavern stock. There are some recipes and whatever if you want to waste your time. There is not a single crafted thing that is worth it in this game. In my opinion. If you insist. It's pointless effort. At least as far as I'm concerned. So I'm pretty sure let's quick save by the way. Yep, uh, here are grave robbers. Let's prepare for the fight and go. Uh, yep. one very nice and for that we get pretty decent bits i mean this armor is decent for your medium armor casters if you use those uh, i mean it's all right gets you physique and dexterity uh, but what we were actually after is this um it's an amazing helmet. And don't uncurse it. The uncursed version is pretty damn bad. And just don't forget to, uh, to swap it uh, whenever you are out of combat. But yeah, it's awesome. Gives you a lot of dexterity, a bit of focus. Okay, e Sharma values and all that. I mean, it used to be more armor as pretty much everything else. I mean, with this gear, before the patch, we would have 100% already. But we are ways away from it. I'm actually not even sure if it's worth it over the barboot in the current day. I mean... Flashing and stabbing is higher and it gives stats. Eh, probably still worth it. We'll see. Once we get our final gear, we will get into the optimization territory. Uh, Black Gazer 2? No. Eyes as you perish. Oh. Ah. 
surrounded by curse. Surrounded by curse. But the patch is out. And it did change the game a decent bit. So I'm poking around, seeing what's up with it. Roth go with you. I guess you are confusing the divider with the Roman too. Let's poke into the tavern, so I will lose out there. I could do that. There. If you Hello. insist. Removed one of the dividers, so it's more obvious. Probably on me. Hmm? I don't believe it affects the prices, but still. So that, anything else, uh, sling will keep, tunic, uh, we can farm those, so we don't need it, uh, next. Make sure that we've read uh, all the recipes and we can sell those as well. Good to go. If you so, what's next? We'll finish the quests later. Uh, this area... I mean, we could do it, it's just a tiny bit spooky there. I would prefer another level beforehand. If you insist. Can I help you? Yeah, we will do that eventually. There we go. Mm. Let's actually open up the map a bit for travel. I guess we could do Delkivar or whatever it's called. Pretty it's sure the insist. devs nerfed insane peasants. At least slightly. Because those guys at least used to be cracked. 
hopefully no longer the case, and we'll be able to murder them. If you insist. And they tell us to fuck off in no uncertain terms. We will absolutely not comply. Basically here you can see the real effects of greed. If you insist. Can I help Hello? You? Yes, we insist. will. And by the way, you can easily see that they are affected by greed, by their glowing green eyes. It's a telltale sign that they are corrupted pretty much beyond any saving. They are undead by now. Eventually, insist. yes. Look into my eyes as you perish. Oh, very nice. Yeah, they... Well, greed is basically a curse from the g evil goddess, more or less, something like that. Look into my eyes as you... If you insist. Ah, surrounded by curse. Ah, surrounded by curse. To Rothgore with Come on, you. hit him. Hit someone. Preferably someone who's injured already. That one. Uh, surrounded by curse. Why are you standing uh, surrounded there? Surrounded by curse. What? Oh, that was a new bug. I've never seen a character just deposing instead of fighting. I mean, at least they, even if it's mm, something cooked, it wasn't like. Just standing. Look into my eye if you yeah. insist. Uh. To Rothgore with you. Uh. Huh. They really do roll quite nicely. Let's load it in auto save. I actually do need to buff. So they were nerfed, just not that nerfed. And the new uh, interrupt system really does fuck us up. Hardcore. You must, if you insist. Well, actually, we can safely rest here. Before the fight starts. So now we can enter. And we'll have time to activate that. Before they charge at us. Look my eyes as you perish. Surrounded by curse. Really? At 99%? Of accuracy, yeah, hit threshold is 25, so it's 75% to hit. Oh, that's not 
Nice. Can we call cough say anything? My heart is dead. Yeah, the peasants are still very much cracked. I don't believe we can learn it right now we can actually uh crimson plague does it do anything good for us right now still no level 3 elevated spells i believe those will be taken by pally not five ah it's six all right i, do I believe we have better spells time. at six but we'll see Can't sleep here. Let's use our heal, that's what it's for. Get armor, go outside. If you insist. Mm. Those are not aggro still, so we can safely murder those. Paint my eyes as you perish. <laughs> Hit me. Thank you. This time, I believe this is the relatively. Oh, as I've said, relatively safe. I'll cut you to little pieces. Oh, do we have some AOE left? Uh, did 
they may test drain party friendly. Oh, Custer's enemies, yeah, they've made it party friendly. So this spell is even better than it used to be. That's awesome. So tiresome. So, get around me. Let me tell you the tale. Well, that should be enough. Get away with it. Still rough goal with you. Still rough goal. Really on the lock frame. Done. Oh, 
hopefully it will let me rest now. So yep. tiresome. And so it did. Um, get armor. Look at my eyes as you perish. Ah, that bug is still in the game. So yeah, and we are at one fifty percent. To Roth go with you. Surrounded by curves. Surrounded Basically, by what curves. happens is when you change locations, buffs double up or triple or whatever. So they can't hold us now. I mean, I don't mind. Speak your on the move. It will go away on location change. I am not loading uh, to fix it. Uh, safe load, by the way, does fix it. Look into my eyes as you perish. <laughs> to Roth Gore with you. Uh, surrounded by curs. Uh. Huzzah, Speak your another mind. level. Don't mind if I do. Peasants, don't be stubborn, if just die. Blood cells. Uh, sir. Uh. Uh, yeah, we do have around 50 50 to hit him, according to the game. Uh. Not that I trust it, but alright. So what happened in this village is they started adding the blood to the wine because it tasted better apparently or something like that and it sold better and they started drinking it themselves and became corrupted. If you insist. And that look into my that. eyes as you perish. To Roth go with you. Got the grapes for later. On the move. So that should be it. I'm pretty sure that was the last of them. Hello. Yes. Oh, apparently not.
Let's go make a circle around it. If you insist. If there are some survivors. Into my eyes yeah, as you here perish. is one. Ugh, surrounded by curse. <laughs> There we go. That was actually it. Can I help you? It's done. See ya. If you insist, speak your mind. On and the now we can loot the place. <laughs> Okay, let's uh, drop the heavy stuff we will never use, or rather it's if not useful. Insist. So now we can go there and... That's another encounter with adventures. Those are not that friendly. I mean, you can be friendly with them, but eh. They do insult us. Look into my eyes if you insist. Spell check. Here they are. actually made them slightly stronger they didn't used to heal i'm pretty sure or maybe it's because i've started with aoe damage one of the two well let's try it again see if we can do it it's harder without 100 percent resistances that's for sure Cost actually. Yes, we can.
actually do somehow do so much damage to us what even hurts us so much with like 70% I believe we are at let me double check my gear I should be at 70%-ish if you insist yeah, I actually am. interrupts it's actually weird now because mobility skills that presumably should save you are positively useless i mean uh the lightning step or whatever it's called that's completely and utterly useless now i mean if you are not being hit you don't need it and if you are being hit it's useless i'm not sure who is it for that you are interrupted so easily. Look into my 
All right, I presumably can, can thin out the crowd some. Yeah, I do. Yeah, surrounded by cats. Oh, that. Yeah, surrounded till Roth go with you. And I'll burn out. Yeah, there is no shot I'm surviving that. Yep. I mean, that voice pack is at least somewhat entertaining. But yeah, with how often we are interrupted these days, I mean, I'm not even sure how will this solo will go. All right. If you insist. I guess we will try it once more. I probably can just kite them out. Till the boards are gone, probably. On the awesome. Just don't get stuck, please. I do your bidding this time. Oh, come on. That was grossly unfair. Oh, I guess serves me right for trying to attack with the weapon and shield. certain terms. Die. 
Uh, no. It's, uh, it's uh, uh, that pack is inbuilt into the game. The it's funny. Post. I don't know, I like it. much life do you have, my dude? Or do that? Whatever that thing is. Ouchie. Attack me. There we go. Thank you. Uh, yes, as I've said, it's proximity based system, so if you move uh, out of their reach, you will not get hit. Oh, our inventory is full. How would you look at that? Here is our second deflection ring. A better to hander. over capacity with our inventory so we'll be back shortly I believe it would be better that way for this we want a few more fangs probably like that actually I believe one hand of mercy is enough. Oh, and here are the Paladin spells, so all of that is completely useless and irrelevant by now. There we go. I'm not sure... Oh, yeah, that's not very useful. I would much prefer having spark. I but then, what can you do? This time. Mm -hmm. 
do we have any spell thingies on them left? Not that I can see. We'll be back in a moment. Let's fix and clear our inventory. Oh, uh, the random encounters are actually back. Oh, that's cool with me. Unless we die miserably. In which case it isn't. Uh, just some gobos. I know we are caring too much. If you gave us slightly more inventory game, that would be better. But new. No. If you insist. Yeah, we'll figure out potions at a later date. Kyo is, by the way, one of the best plate armors in the game. Which we can't wear. So we'll sell it. Yeah. If you insist. By type. See your wares, and we are selling that and that. Armbands can go, boots, gauntlets, ruby, rings and necklaces. Good. If you insist. Arrows. Let's sort it. Anything else? Yeah. I'd like to drop that and the entirety of that. And let's loot and sell the rest. That should afford us a shield we want from that dude. And it's best to buy stuff early because greed affects prices. The higher the greed, the higher are the prices. If you insist. 
And there we go. That's the remaining gear. That's one of the better light armors in the game. That's probably the best short sword in the game. Um, they are usually not. Most of them are not. But it's random where exactly they are, unless you are playing seated. But they are generally not too far. Like library is... Uh, always in the um, uh, in the southern part somewhere. Obelisk is to the east, if memory serves. Um, Kraken is pretty much always uh, in the marsh somewhere. Uh, the ice cave is up north. Invariably, it's just not concrete where exactly depends on the map sometimes they do spawn in weird locations like Gobo Town is pretty much always uh, in the goblin territory so find where a lot of goblins are and there you go As uh, for our deeds here, I mean, that ring will serve us nicely outside of that. Oh, we probably don't care all that much, so let's uh, get back into the city once again. Uh, sell the remaining gear, and we probably will have enough for the shield. If you insist. Oh, that's a new encounter, actually. My eyes as you perish. Ah, uh, would you please die? Well, apparently not. Pointless. Uh, do I have something left? Yeah, I do have a bit. Surrounded by curse. Surrounded by curse. There goes one.
I'll cut pieces. Oh, for real, didn't die. Oh, that was a very much unneeded crit, but all right. Sure thing. Let's rest and hope we will. Yeah, yes, that doesn't happen. Uh, can we move now? Not yet. There we go. Freedom. Come on, move. No, no, there. Come on. That's just plain stupid. Move out of there. Well, I guess I should have saved. Or rather, I should have just went to the town. I actually forgot you can be accosted twice in a row. Uh, I mean, that you can be accosted on the random encounter tile. There. Speak your breakfast. Uh, let's get our weapons up. Don't believe we gained anything of note, did we? Uh, not quite. Got some slots, and that kinda is right. Let's rest a second time, just in case. There we go. If you insist. Now let's go sell. We might or might... No, we are not ganked on the way. I mean, obviously, now that we are rested. And the memory leak strikes again. We'll have to relaunch the game. Otherwise, loading times will kill me. It's faster to relaunch. Are we capturing? I believe we do. So well, that's nice. If you insist. Yeah. Yeah. Show me your wares. So that, 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 that.
Hmm. Playing, I don't know. That will go for sure. And we already have a pair of full pine threads, I believe, so can sell that as well. Right? Yes. I'll leave that for now. Uh, let's actually slot one identify. In case we will need it. If you insist. All right. With that, uh, let's check our cash. Yeah, we have well enough if for the expenses. Uh, let's go buy ourselves a beaching new shield Huzzah. what oh it's a large shield sheet oh that's unfortunate well at least i know that it's there i guess we will roll with whatever we usually are rolling with uh whatever that is uh, what's a good medium shield I actually didn't check. If you insist. Well, I guess we have enough cash for the rest of the game then. Because there isn't much to buy. Check the database for the game real fast. What shields can we have? Can we hope to get? Uh, it's weapons now. I want armor. I believe they are there. That one is not in the game. Mm. Yeah, I wish it was. That one is so good. Oh, what can we hope for? Oh yeah, that's okay. Oh, where is that again? Ah, Crimson Crossing. All right. On the move. That's fine. And in the meantime, I... Ah, yeah, that's also right. Let's go to the Fazit Grove and finish our escapade there, I guess. If you insist. Hello, bandits. Mm. 
Look into my eyes as you perish. Surrounded by curs. You actually managed to interrupt me. Surrounded by curs. by curse. Surrounded by curs. Treasures. And that costs like nothing. Same with that. Uh, actually, yeah, let's drop everything in into this bush and that will be fine. If I ever need cash, I'll go back to it. I'll cut you into little pieces. Yes, I know. Spooders from all over the map. And that will be way faster. Yes, and thank you. Uh, let's first do that. If you can. Nope. Uh, let's try it again. Thank you. Hell take so tiresome. Just clean up manually. So our focus is at 10 right now. Not too bad already. And we 
are at 19.95 and if we swap not too bad yes i know <laughs> Hello? Yep. Take that quest. Inside there is a piece of the great sword, but it's a paperweight in the inventory for now if you insist as we don't have the other parts here it is we would just leave it here and the rest is nothing special just some reagents which we will never use so off we go What's more important is to get our medium armor. And our medium armor is like north of here. Which we will do, but not right now. Let's go in order ish and kill the elves first after all if we get there with some experience under our belt it will be beneficial to us And yeah, we technically could tell the elves if you insist. Uh, that we are peaceful and all, but there is absolutely no benefit to us. So I don't believe it's a good solution. interrupts are starting to get on my nerves i mean we've increased our focus reasonably 
And that did absolutely nothing, really. If you insist. plates even though when ones are still considered heavy I mean it would be mm, more interesting if they were not exclusive and could be wear by mages but whatever For now, we'll yank him on the way out. Blood and souls. I do your bidding this time. There we go. That another elven troops or whatever they are. Guess what? That's 
another one down. Hell, take the hindmost, tiresome. Yeah, I mean, technically it's a sequence break attacking them beforehand. Can we rest now? Cool. On the move. And there is one more group of elves. Blood and Here they are. everything that's somewhat useful to us. There are some elven adventurers. I believe they are like here somewhere. They will meet the same fate as their brethren. Ah, here they are. Yeah. Uh, so, same deal with them. Except a bit of preparation. And I guess goblin killing in this case. If you insist. Surround the 
chaos. Speak your mind. I do your bidding this time. So, killed elves, killed... Oops. Ah, uh, yeah. Managed to run away. Survive the first volley. Uh, the best option is to just break through the front line and murder them. Uh, next best thing is to have your second line have throwers. They do nicely. But yeah, basically rush them. If you insist. Look into my eyes as you perish. Till wrath go with you. Plus your own archer or archers uh, should participate and kill them faster than they kill you. There is also that. Welcome gear upgrades. That cloud walkers, more intelligence, more focus, so that probably better than plate. That's uh, yeah, that's fireball light armor. It's very nice. Mm. 
more balls. Can do that. in so far as gear goes. Ah, yeah. It is actually better now. Pretty cool. Minus 15 heat resistance still will hurt though, so I'm not sure. Pretty good though. And speed wise, it's in 5 seconds. By the way, is Giant's Needle the same as I am used to? Yeah, it looks the same. Meditation bracelet, I do not particularly care. Gobbles. Yay, not interrupted. Who would have guessed? Can we rest now, please? If you insist. Ah. Uh. Okay. Yeah, I probably need a few more of the heals. Let's get that sorted. That's slow, right? Movement of all creatures inside. No, that's completely useless. We don't want that.
useless to me that's like 50 gold I don't care uh, same with that and I can drop the stones don't care Would be nice if the game told me uh, prices, but okay. I guess that's fine. Giant's Needle we already have. Soon we'll get even better. I did Long sword this time. for ourselves. Mm. Actually, let's go to the Merchant's Road. And buy ourselves the Flambridge. If you insist. Uh, no, not Merchant's Road actually, I mistaken it. But whatever. Let's go to the town then. I probably will not sell the... Well, some of the stuff. Let's leave a few exhibits. but I mean as I've stated we no longer really need money if you insist that far if you I mean we've done pretty much no uh, story stuff yet Mm -hmm. 
basically what we are doing right now is we are clearing locations we can clear before going anywhere in particular uh, getting some experience uh, that sort of deal Granted, this part you will do more or less the same way, even if you are playing the game with a party and not solo. On the move. Uh, reason for that is uh, companions get XP when you hire them. So if you can solo everything before the um, oh before starting story stuff, and uh, you at least get decently ahead. Uh, I'm playing Templar Winter Mage. It says so right over there. Speaking of which, so what's next? Templar Winter Mage is very strong for the reason that Winter Mage provides a lot of AoE spells and uh, it scales uh, very nicely, better than any other mage in the game. So if you are looking for spell damage, Winter Mage is your guy pretty much. I mean, sure, we will not have Fireball, but that's a small price to pay overall. Look into my eyes, oh. And right now we are, yeah, getting XP, gearing, all that sort of deal. Come on, that poor shit. There we go. Till Roth goes. On. Till Roth goes. Surrounded by curses. Gotta say, I really hate new interrupt system. Interrupts were already cancelled before the update, and with the update it's like way worse than it used to be. Are you kidding me? This time. I'll cut There we go. Shroud we can get elsewhere. Crippling Ray is completely useless. Uh, 
Oh, what does that do? Mm, that looks actually fine. So, let's take it, I guess. I'm not sure if we can get it somewhere. I don't believe so. Ah, I mean. Gale Shroud I know for sure is for sale. Uh, that one we'll find later. Not that we are gonna use it at all. So I guess. Hello there. Yeah, pretty much. Except I found out that uh, there actually is no uh, Fang spell for sale, so that needs to be replaced with something. Uh, not yet sure what exactly. But yeah, uh, generally it, it is the same build. Templar's Mace. That one is actually new, I believe. all that impressive actually yes, I, know. I mean there is a fresh uh, unfair and build in case you haven't seen it So they go to happy with Massacre Vale. So yeah, uh, there is unfairy and party build out there. It's alright, I mean. I've cleaned unfair with it, so... I guess it was fine. If you insist... Stop. Don't touch him. So, speak ghost. Yeah. 
Yes, we save the orphanage, then we... horse basically we behave uh, we answer as if we are complete idiot as that's what the game wants from us Yeah, it is similar to the original Baldur's Gates, I guess, the most. It's rather simplistic, I mean, the writing is alright. Uh, generally, the game is fine. There is nothing extremely wrong or good about it. I mean, it's an alright game. If you have nothing to play, it will entertain you well enough. If you do... Uh, keep playing what you're playing. Basically that. But yeah, uh, basically it's uh, very close to the first Pillars game, I guess. Uh, that would be kind of the closest relative to it. If you insist. I obviously do wish they've done something differently, but I mean, ain't it always like that? Yes, it's a Unity game. And unlike Roth, it does have a lot of Unity problems, as in memory leaks and you know, stuff like that. As I've said, it's very much akin to Pillars. And yeah, I do believe uh, they are still working on Avowed, although they are suspiciously quiet about it. I would have thought they have something in the in the works, and no, apparently not. I mean, I would expect a barrage of marketing materials by now, but nope, it's really quiet like very much suspiciously so so i'm not sure what to think on of it i mean i guess i mean it's not been officially cancelled at least so there is that Uh, but generally, such 
quietness usually means one of three things. Either the development goes as badly as it can, like key people will leave and everything is in turmoil and they do prefer to keep a lead on it. That's option number one. Uh, option number two is Microsoft acquisition. Uh, and maybe poured in a lot more money so they are scaling up the project and they if are preferring insist. to keep quiet about it that's kind of the best case scenario and the last option is if you insist yeah. uh the cart marketing budget for the game at all uh, like pretty much completely And that would be why it's quiet. So what? let's just hope it's the scaling up uh, option. Oh, sometimes also it's when there is a 180 turn in development. So, for example, it was developed as a third-person Elder Scrolls-ish game. Uh, and that didn't work out, so they are uh, going 180 on it. So that's also an option. In which case we will hear about the game not soon at all, as it was mm, at least done enough to do promotional materials at some point. So if they went to square one, uh, that's no good at all. If you insist. And that would indicate that the game was turning to shit, now uh, they probably done a demo or something and it uh, basically focus group says yeah guys that's hot garbage and back to square one they are Time. Let's get our reward. Mainly the XP. It's there and there. Speak your mind. Can I help you? Yep. Those boots are... Oh, they are slightly nerfed uh, as well. Immunity to knockdown is not too bad though. I believe that one is added, but they've cut pulse and blow resistance by half. I mean, fair enough. Pulse and blow is the easiest to get. So, if you insist. it's not a big loss. Interruption chance, is it for us or for enemies, I wonder? Well, in either case, and we don't care. We don't care about our interruption chance, and we don't particularly care about enemies either. I mean, they interrupt us a lot anyway. If you insist. And while it's still daytime, let's go. 
into the bright guard headquarters there is a jailer or something in there who wants the amulets back his brother was slightly ghoulified he will be delighted to hear that news if you insist what See, he is happy. If you insist. And off we go. So next order of business is to go. Uh, to the, well, whatever that is, go forth. Nope, uh, reputation is completely and utterly useless as far as I know. I mean, some NPCs will react slightly differently to you, but it's it has pretty much no bearing on the game. Uh, greed, however, greed has a noticeable impact on pretty much all aspects of the game. And greed affects prices, rewards, uh, uh, NPC hostility, very much all that. back and hopefully they will be hostile what do you need yes no well we'll come back later then let's go kill some wolfies and whatnot uh, the place we actually need is here flowers and while it's night time let's go visit the local cleric he will give us a quest to exterminate uh, shades or whatever they're called in this one they're basically shades not as cancerous as in Baldur's Gate as they don't drain you to shit uh one if you insist i've beaten the game on release like half a year ago i didn't know they are so such an aggressive cookie Stop slowing me down. Thank you. Yeah, the interruption resistance we supposedly got from the boots uh, is not exactly uh, working, is it? I'm surrounded by cash. Speak blood and sir. I do your bidding this time. Buried very nice. Oh, that was a nice hit, at least. I 
Surrounded by curs. That one. Let's get rid of this slow if we can. Okay. Someone worked. But yeah, the game is not all that complicated as to if you insist. Speak your mind. Uh, and give me problems remembering most stuff. Got the branch. Mm. We already had one of those, I believe. We sold it. If you insist. Yes. If you insist. If you insist. Oh, let's yoink stuff out here. There we go. Oh, I know what we can invest our money in, actually. Uh, we can get, like, that bottomless bag, which is, insist. I guess, bag of holding or whatever. And some containers for the stuff we got. That would probably be smart. It's not like we have stuff to spend on. You? Wait, you uh, we've insist. seen these souls. We actually told them that everything is hunky-dory, and they can rest in peace. Not so sure what that's supposed yes. to be about. Uh, berry juice, relaxation, and cure-all. Now uh, we should have them in town. Yeah, the game is not bad. It's a good vacation game, insist. for example. I mean, I uh, can see taking it with me on vacation and spending like a few hours in the evening when I have nothing to do. Stuff like that. I mean, games like this, I generally come from the point of mm, zero expectations and the game either surprises me or not. Uh, this one did not surprise me, it's uh, good enough, insist. but probably like it's not a masterpiece or cult classic in the hey! making or something like that. <sighs> yeah, there we go. 
restless spirits are slightly less restless now. So yeah, if you treat this game as um, like okay entertainment, yeah, sure, uh, it's great for that. Uh, if uh, you expect like I don't know, like on the real levels of indie development, no, it's not that, not at all. If you insist. But then there is only one on the rail. And there are countless indie games. Yes. Yeah, don't Speak need any reward. Mind. So we have nine levels ahead. So we can max out one more weapon style. I guess I'll go for... Eh. I mean, I don't particularly want anything. Oh, let's try new throwing. See how that goes. On the move. Yeah, I mean, eighteen bucks is pretty fair. Into my uh, how exactly does the wolf have three pelts? I get three pieces of meat, but three pelts. are dead enough. Get the potion of whatever from them. So all I need is restoration potion. Yes, I know. Alrighty. So what can we yoink next? Uh, we can do the fisherman quest, I guess.
Uh, some spells do have uh, AoE. I mean, it says it in the description always. Uh, so here it says uh, to all affected creatures inside the area of effect, uh, which means it's not party friendly. And on this one, uh, it says casters enemies. So basically that one is not no, party friendly. And the other one is. Yeah. It says here on whoever happens to stand underneath them. So anyone, including your party. Or say this, uh, same. And damaging anyone who's caught in it. So, anyone means anyone. Can I help you? Yep, I uh, got the quest to hunt down kobolds. We'll do that. If you insist, we'll move out anyway in that direction. So, why not? Oh, that's actually new after the patch. I mean, she, I believe, didn't have a portrait. If you insist. Here is another companion which we will not get. base uh, belong to us. Pepperidge Farm remembers.
Yay, we were not accosted by any enemies. This time. Oh, really? So annoying. I'll cut you into little pieces. Yeah. Trader. Uh, yep, I uh, don't need his belt. As you can see, the greed decreases. So we are at negative 18. Hmm. Yep, let's take a look. Does he sell anything interesting? Like, who knows? The devs did shake up uh, stuff at least a little. This one is still kind of alright-ish. I mean, I believe they've made it better, actually. Let's try it. I mean, if anything, we do have the money. So might as well experiment a little. Uh, the school cap, yeah, that one is still trash, though. Does he have Potion of Restoration, I believe it was, uh, we needed? I guess not. We'll have to visit town for it after all. So that... Uh, don't need that. Finally, did fix the Dwarven Warhammer. Uh, Garnet stuff we can safely sell, don't need it. So, let's try the poisonous blade. Ah, uh, it's an elven belt. Uh, he said it so himself. Uh, that thing. We've looted and sold Hell, like 20 of those from the elves we massacred recently. Well, Bor is not only poisoned, but also dead. So, I guess that means it's a good sword. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> 
But yeah, our goal is to keep our greed uh, at zero. I do your bidding this time. As we do need it. Speak your Hello. mind. What seems to be the problem? What must I do? Yep, she wants us to plead, uh, to plant the seed. Which in a second we'll learn that is not is such a great idea. Local druid will be very much opposed to it. Basically what happens is, uh, you guessed it, the dryad is cursed or some shit. Yes, I know. And our immediate goal is to obviously uncurse her as you do. Otherwise, you are getting a bad ending to the quest. And most importantly, you are not getting OP earrings. Yes, we did. We need some time, so we'll go to the tree. I believe we learned what we needed. Yeah, completing Roth is an arduous task, isn't it? The game is so long. Especially going in blind. If you insist. Look into my eyes as you perish. To Roth go with you. Well, would you please, yeah, brutalize that one? Very nice. Um. The rest we don't need. We've all the money we could have wanted for, for a quite a long while. But yeah, uh, Roth is, I mean, my main gripe with Roth is very much a subpar plot for the most part. After Kingmaker, it's such a letdown. I'm glad to see that uh, Rogue Trader writing is improved even in Alpha, it's already way better than it if is in Rogue. Well, 
Oh, Rogue Trader is probably out like in September ish. Uh, all cats usually releases in autumn, so I would bet on September or October. So it's not all that long to wait, like half a year. I mean, granted, if it releases this year, well, next year. If you insist. Uh, it probably will. I mean, even Alpha is surprisingly a lot of the game already. Like it's, it looks like it's almost done. Hello. Yep, take it to the dryad. So let's go take it to the dryad. Um, I guess we should uh, take a precaution and equip some persuasion gear. I don't remember if we need it, I'm pretty sure we don't, but, I mean, better safe than sorry. And I'll quick save just in case. Hello! Yep, fair oh. well, uh, she is very much happy about it. Now we go to the Druid guy, I believe, and tell him that the Dryad is cured. Nobody died, nobody went insane. Hmm. Good ending to the quest indeed. Yes. Don't need your stinking reward. Well, I mean, they've been developing it in-house under the Shroud of Darkness or whatever. Uh, but yeah. Uh, uh, they've said that they are working on a new project pretty much when uh, the Roth released, more or less. And it made sense that it would not be a new Pathfinder game. I was betting on a Starfinder, but I mean, business-wise, it way makes way more sense. Uh, that it's not. Warhammer license is rather cheap. Hello. Speak your mind. So, talk to the droid, oh, talk to the druid. What? Yeah, there we go. And here are the OP earrings. Which we will immediately wear. And as you can see, uh, yeah, they are pretty damn good now. That's a least and a half. I do your bidding this time. Oh, it's to be fair, mostly stats. I mean, 5% to everything in these days when pretty much all the armor was nerfed is also pretty damn insane, in all fairness. I mean, it was, like, nice but not crucial previously, but nowadays, actually, it's probably even better than that. Plus one to everything, and plus five percent to everything. Yeah, that's insist. fair enough. Hello. 
look into my eyes as you perish. <laughs> Oh, it resisted poisoned. Oh, that's bad news. Bad news boars in this case. Uh, doesn't do the earrings actually give us uh, block? I don't remember. Oh, it, they give us dodge. Our dodge is at 25% and without a ring at 20 on the dot. So the ring still has full effect. Nice. becoming more competent uh, by the minute blood and cells not interrupted as much either mainly because enemies don't hit us as much Magical rock, all that. Uh, here is a place for later. It's basically just a landmark, which you are presumed to remember, but yeah, uh, chances of you actually remembering it on the first try without searching the whole map up and down are kind of slim. I know I didn't. But yeah, when a certain NPC tells you to find bandits at the flying rock, uh, that's... Uh, or magical rock, whatever. Uh, basically, that's the place. The game sometimes does suffer of the where the fuck do I go syndrome. So, Fish Thieves, O3 Rex, okay. That's nice and all. Uh, let's go to the Windmere's Grove. Ha, <laughs> sure. Dredging stuff from the fridge. I is my sort of ordeal which reminds me i probably should make myself some coffee also So this guy will tell us that there's nothing there is nothing of interest just yet. Yeah, blah blah. Well, before we find liquor thieves, uh, we need to murder those guys. Perish. 
being a star thing. So right. Awesome. Oh, the adventurers are very much dead. You wouldn't believe it, but it is actually a pretty dangerous encounter. I mean, you probably are not supposed to kill them. Well, guess what? We absolutely do kill them. That's another pair of Cloud Walkers. Eastern Tarsh. Base block chance of 16 versus 15. Well, we are at 25% block anyway. Tormentor is absolutely awesome, uh, but uh, yeah. Uh, we'll first need uh, to uncurse it. sorts of good stuff. And here is our big big sword, I promised. I mean, we can easily compare Crimson Kiss to the old one. Yeah. So we have a big dick sword now, that's nice, and we got ourselves a new plate, the only issue is we have to go back and uncurse it, uh, which will not be a problem. Uh, this one, it's worse than what we are using, so that's a wash. Pretty nice dagger, which we will not use, as we are not a short sword person, like at all. Those are for thieves and whatnot. Thieves and clerics. Those do enjoy it. Uh, this is, uh, I believe it's called Cataclysm or whatever. Uh, it's basically slider to the right. Ah, Courier. There you go. Cataclysm is from the Celeste. healing bits. Uh, where is the local dude so we don't have to find him later? He usually digs around somewhere along this road. 
There he is. Can I help you? Yes. We agree. Greetings. Here it is. We already grabbed it previously. Yep. And we will use the reward as you do Speak your in mind. this game. As it's just money and money is worthless. So tiresome. So before we are fighting uh, the alcohol thieves, uh, we will uh, go here and uncurse our stuffs. As I do want to use the Tormentor. That armor is absolutely gorgeous, and I wouldn't mind using it. Ah, uh, Russia, Moscow, that's where I'm from. If you insist. So yeah, uh, just your average Russian Jewish dude. So next order of if business is to sell our stuff and to uncur stuff. Temple services. Uh, yeah, sure, let's pay the money. So there we go, that's the uncursed version. It actually adds physique in, instead of removing it. These stats are also very nice, so we are sitting pretty at 57 stabbing, 43 slashing, 48 pulse and blow, which is decent enough. With the armor of hmm, what's his face. Onarius, yeah, that one. On the move. Greetings. It's actually pretty decent. Uh, let's sell the garbage we don't need. the rest into the bucket. And we'll hoard it. It's not like we need the cash. This time. Yeah, Moscow is pretty beautiful if you, if you go in winter, mainly. Autumn and spring are pretty horrendous because it's just dirt and rain everywhere. Basically, we are in a constant contest with the uh, London for the shittiest weather on the planet. If I had to guess.
but yeah, jokes aside, um, uh, if you wanna come, it's best to come in winter. Yeah, it can be. I mean, sometimes it's not, but your chances of catching actually good uh, autumn weather are pretty slim. Uh, so I would come at like uh, either beginning of the summer, like late spring maybe, uh, or uh, in winter. Oh, and also uh, book the theaters beforehand, like good half a year beforehand, if you want to go there. Because those are pretty much always booked <laughs> about, well, at least a few months prior. That's kind of just the norm. Museums, not so much. Museums, you can uh, just get a ticket and go. But theaters, yeah, those do tend to be overbooked, like hardcore. Well, unless you are willing to pay, like, five times the price. Mm -hmm. yes. Look into my eyes as you perish. Well, here it's mostly weekends that are busy, so if you go to the museum on the weekday, you pretty much will have it all for yourself, more or less. That's the good part about vacations. Everyone is working, and you are not. So yeah, make sure it's not like some sort of a national holiday and you'll be fine. On the moon, blood and cells. Oh yeah, uh, and uh, 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 book a, a hotel in either southwest of Moscow or in the center, otherwise uh, it might not be a pleasant stay. Not only because those are worth uh, uh, generally, but it's also socio-economic stuff. Can I help you? Uh, in Moscow you will be fine, probably. I mean, I highly doubt anyone will harass a tourist. And in general, in Moscow, really, uh, that's the good part about the city. Nobody really gives a fuck about who you are. But if you are going to tour Russia, yeah, that might not be safe at the best of times. Even for a Russian citizen. I mean, neither do I, but in all fairness, I would not go to any place with an extradition treaty uh, with the US right now. And not because I am uh, 
a fugitive of, of some sort. Oh, that's actually cool. If you don't fight the Liquor Thief, there is a band of adventurers here. Uh, let's murder them. Can catch me. Fuck on the top. Oh, you know what? I also have that. So, now let's slap each other. So cool now, are you? Well, if they didn't want to be killed, they probably should have, for example, I don't know, not carry so much valuable gear with them. How about that? Oh, so that's where Templar's friend is. Well, don't mind if I do. Very nice. Too bad our block is kept out, which we can actually help a bit. Yeah, now it's not. That's probably better. Cat rings are also valuable. We are losing 3% in everything, but we are gaining 15% accuracy, which we can't really complain about. Our accuracy is not immaculate. So,
Yeah, I know, right? I mean... That's kind of common sense now. done with this map let's go save uh, the dude well I actually didn't know where the Templar uh, belt is but apparently now I know I really should add it to the site Unless I forget, in which case I won't. But I probably will not forget. I'll go there to change the spell list for the Templar anyway. If you insist. Uh, we have three... No, uh, five. What's our armor uh, looking like? I mean, we are almost at the point where we will end the game as gear-wise. Uh, 70s, huh? That's pretty disappointing, to be fair. Well, maybe I'll swap Cloud Walkers for something. Armor-ish. But I don't believe I can find more armor elsewhere. So that's just a new reality. Very hard to get a hundred. Yeah. Oh. 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 
Murder. I love murder. The demon told me to. Can I help you? Yeah, your your life. Not in the least because he decided not to murder you as well. Let's get back to the quest giver. Let's hope the duty is generous enough. I mean, if I recall correctly, for the greedless path, it's nothing, and otherwise it's, I believe, also nothing, or close to it. I mean, nothing unique. If you insist. Can Hello. I help you? Yes, they'll keep the reward. There we go. Poachers are nice and happy. Much unlike the elves, who are nice and dead. Now we can rest and go to the Winter's Grove. Here we will find ourselves the above mentioned liquor thieves. They are actually kinda spooky ish. I mean, they at least used to spam stealth and stab you in the back for a lot of damage, which is not possible to do by the game rules, but I mean, they still did it. Despite the fact that the armors that provide uh, hide and shadow things actually only do that, I believe, once per day. Well, we will see if that was fixed. If you insist. Hello, thieves. Actually, before we do that, I believe, mm, I actually... 
Oh yeah, man. He does do good work. Uh, what I forgot to do is to get the truth out of them. And we do need that. Because of reasons. But yeah, Acid Rain is an amazing spell for the mostly early game, but even later it's still pretty nice. I believe that should do it. Ah, and the head slot. There we go, that should work. If you insist. case they run away and we don't want that either uh, let me relaunch the game actually uh, memory leak slows the loads to way too much it will be faster this way but yeah acid rain is great because it's uh, dot and it's party friendly uh, now i'm pretty sure it wasn't at least at some point But now it's way, 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 way better than it was. There. That should be correct. So I need to remember to attack them. If you insist. Yep, yep, yep. Uh. Yes, and switch everything back. Oh. 
There we go. Now we know everything we needed to know. I'm not sure if it's important, but whatever. Don't actually remember what the good solution for the quest is, but... Doesn't matter to me. Blade Cracker... It's good for the block chance, but not anything else. 8... Uh, 8, 5, 10 now. No, thank you. Although, I mean, is it better actually? Uh, what's my... 45, 54, 40. Forty-four, fifty-two, same forty. Yeah, I do believe heater is better. And my block is maxed out anyway. Shadow Dagger, ah, they've added never seen to it once per day. Oh, that's actually cool. I mean, Rogue sucks slightly less with it, probably. I do your bidding this time. Uh, let's go back to the clearing, uh, tell the girl her shipment is done and gone. They've spent all the money they've gained on cocaine and whores. And now they are dead. So that's a small price for her. And that's pretty much everything we could have done before uh, doing the story part. So if you are... Uh, well, yeah. If you are doing it uh, with a party, that's pretty much the point where you are yes. starting to hire. donate some cash to her instead. I mean, we don't care about cash anyway, and it decreases our greed, increases reputation, all that jazzy stuff. Oh wait, uh, did I get restoration now so if we'll we need insist. to drop by market street we need to yoink Potion of whatever's uh, restoration was it right? If you I insist. believe. Or relaxation, let's see. Yeah, petals we collected, we'll return them on the way out. Uh, relaxation. So, that one. Yoink. Oh, 
uh, we'll figure that out later. Uh, for now, I want to grab as much as I can carry from this box. Oh, not to that extent. I'll leave like two slots open. On the move. And there is a reason for that. Now we are relocating those boxes to the place that doesn't get reset when the next chapter is a go. I don't remember. Is it uh, that guy who wanted the petals? Greetings. Ah, he wants the stone. Uh, stone, yeah, that will happen later. If you insist. I mean, we can get him this stone pretty much right now. If we grab our thief friend and re-steal. If you insist. Uh, the quest item from the wish we gave it. <laughs> but, I mean. Yep. Can I help she you? gave us a pretty useless robe. go if you insist let's transfer our wealth while we're at it and finish two quests in here that should level us up among other things and we are suddenly level 13. Which, mind you, you probably shouldn't be at this point. Although, on courier and whatnot, I'm not sure how you are even supposed to survive otherwise. Overleveling is key. No, 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 that's mine. All this stuff we don't need, however. Load our quest dealies. Hello. Yes. Yep. Don't need payment. See ya. Her reward is actually reasonably hard to skip normally. She gives a pretty nice bow. Can I help you? Yeah, and father is very much happy that his kids are safe, no thanks to him. If you insist. Very convenient position. For him, yeah, I'm can I help a useless slob and I can't do anything.
and he gives us a trident. And as I said, we did level up indeed. some new spells. I'm actually not sure which one to take. I'll see in a second. Let's not level up actually. On the move. In that case. Decent. Uh, let's drop off potions that are left over. Don't need those. Drop that. Don't need it. And here is the trident. It's eh. I mean, the damage is not hopeless, at least not completely. But that's no reason to use pole arms. The halberd that gives plus 5 physique uh, could be But obviously it's not for us at all If you insist. And that's most of the wealth transfer gone and done. I mean, it's best to do now than later. We are not quite done with the act, but it's it will fly real fast. By the way, what you guys say, should we do companion quests or fuck them? I mean, I will probably do Arvik's uh, quest now that it's finished. I haven't seen it. If you but other than that, I've hmm, no inclination one way or the other. I probably, I kind of do want uh, to do Bialis stuff real fast as it does give us very much Speaking needed on. stuff. Namely, it will give us access. On the uh, to the library at the Wizards College or whatever it's called there. So, quest-wise, uh, what's left? Ah, yeah, need to turn in that quest. Uh, that will span the whole game, so that's whatever. That's for later. Yeah, I do we are done this time. with the side stuff. So, I guess let's turn in the quest.
for the gravekeeper first and then uh what else was there left i mean i still need to transfer my herbs but that's whatever if ah yes insist. i wanted to do biela stuff And I want to buy Glacial Scroll, but I don't remember which one has it. Was it you or the other guy? Uh, the other guy. All right. If uh, let's insist. pay a visit to the Gravekeeper then. Are there other undeads there? Or do I actually need... Well, Alright, uh, let's On the move. go visit uh, every crypt. Not so sure what that's about. Yeah, cleared there. I'm pretty sure it was uh, just two ghosts in the first one. Oh no! Look into my Here eyes is another one. You insist. Well, it makes sense why uh, he's not all that happy with us. Standing firm. Uh, oh, so that's block and parry. As if we needed more. Well, not that I'm complaining. If you insist. Oh to yeah, Rothgore, they've you? actually added stuff. Those creeps used to be empty. If you insist. Well, at least there is no reason to visit those. Fury and complaining. Ugh, surrounded by curse. Yeah, we are surrounded by turds. If you insist. Speak your mind. As the character insists. On the move. Or curse, or curse. Uh, one of the if three. You insist. To Rothgor with you. go quest complete hopefully gravekeeper is very much happy with us if you hmm. insist locked huh 
how about we kick it in now? Oh, they removed the option. Speak your mind. I mean, it does nothing now. Yeah, On the moon. that's actually funny. I do your bidding. This look into my eyes as you perish. Surrounded by curs. What a lucky guy. I believe he has like 1% of status effect and he dropped us twice. It's like Ross numbers already. Oh, well, I guess. If you insist. Yep, that quest is done. If you insist. So time to go to the castle district and look at the embassy stuff. It's daytime, so. That will do nicely. If you insist. Uh, from the guards with the torches at night, uh, you can pickpocket uh, the same shield over and over again. Uh, you can get like, I believe, three of those here. It's decent money in the early game if you need it. it and exists. lots of gems. Uh, from the nobles. If you insist. Yeah, another barboot. I uh, will take it. Not because we need it, but we'll hoard it anyway. Because we can. If you insist. Oh, that container is locked. Well, we can remedy that. The guard is unhappy with noise again, so we'll have to re-enter the area. Basically, what happens if there is, uh, as I have explained earlier, but just in case, um, what happens there is mm, you uh, get two warnings, well, one warning, and then they attack. So, what you do is obviously... Uh, get out and re-enter, or you can save load. Too much the same effect. Yep, stop that right now. And this bit of tech is very important even if you do have a thief. 
Um, NPCs often do see through stealth and pretty much anything. So instead of alerting them, you can just reset the area and do your thing. If they you don't insist. need the possessions anyway. And they will go to the fund of, of the greater good, which is us. Yes. Yep. Very well. I forgot to trigger a cutscene where we are denied access to the library. The dude can very much help us. Actually, if we are doing Bialas quest anyway for the scrolls, might as well skip it. We'll come here with Biala and do our thing that way. If you insist. And embassies do have decent amount of scrolls and whatnot. So we will help ourselves to that. If you insist. Nope, don't need that. Yoink. That's locked. Not anymore. Well, let's actually check which one is faster. Yeah, going back and forth is totally faster. But yeah, you can save load. As you can see, uh, NPCs reset just as fine. If you insist. Nope. Yes. Uh, don't mind if I yoink that. Almost done with the embassies. If you insist. Don't care. Yeah, give me that. Particularly care about the ring. Yeah, that I would get. If you insist. The ring is decently valuable, but it's. Eh. Uh, what it says 240 or uh, 140, even worse. Yeah, it's a fireball scroll which we don't need. Uh, Dune Repo. Yeah, 
Yeah, we desperately need a better level to spell to slot in there. Oh, and that's actually powered in spells. Let's get at least some of them. Berserk, uh, which is why you don't need the actual, uh, whatever it's called, Berserk. Uh, dazzling Light, I guess we can slot a few of those. What we surely don't need is a billion of the icicles, they are... I mean, they are alright, but they are not amazing. That looks way better. And now we have Dance of the Desert Wind. I mean, it's not all that great, but... Um, I mean, it's better than nothing. Pretty good marching. I believe it's the same as. Well, point is, it's short. So, yeah. Don't need, don't care. So, we need level 5 and 6 elevated uh, stops. Alright. On the move. So that's all the embassies done. Uh, let's look for levels. Oh, they fixed uh, learning stuff we shouldn't be able to. Like Dune Ripple. Sadly, I mean, we should be able to, but we can't. Not anymore. At least I'm pretty sure. Well, anyway. Is it evening already? Yeah. Let's wait into the day. And I believe that's the last one. Sadly, we were not able to rob all the embassies. Found the glacial rush. That's amazing. Dexterity is odd, so maybe actually we don't need so many first level slots no more. Yeah, that looks just fine. How long does this last? 11 turns? I'll think on it. Don't need it right now. I'd rather get Glacial Rush. Uh, 
Ah, yeah, it's the single target uh, stuff that, yeah. I mean, pulse and blow effects, that would be nice if, they, if the hammers weren't so slow. Oh, what's that? I mean, I don't care, I'll yank On it. The move. That's the second Persuasion Bracer, I'm pretty sure. Oh, I tossed the other one into the bin. Well, too bad. If you insist. If you insist. Well, dude, sharing is caring. Thanks for your kind donation. Oh, they've changed the spell on this one. It's Icicle Lance one now. Mm. I might actually consider using it over the cat eye ring. I'll think on it. For now we are done clearing out embassies. Don't believe there is anything else here. If you so. insist. Let's grab Yala by the ear and visit the... Uh, whatever it's called, uh, basically the Magic Academy thing. If you insist. Speak your mind. By the way, did that clear itself? We have base spells, we don't have elevated spells. That one. Specified and confused, huh? Hmm. I mean, it is pretty garbage. But then we don't particularly need anything. So. And here is Dune Ripple, which can. Uh, due to a bug, only be learned from the level up. But it's a base spell and we don't care about it all that much. can explode the stuff from here. We are missing level 5 elevated slot. 
Huh. Whoops. Yes. Oh, yeah. Hello, Biala. I'm Speak your mind. Yes. Yep. Talk, talk, talk. You have enough. So there we go. I will not bother leveling her. Don't care. If you insist. She is a spell weaver. She is overall not all that bad. She is not the best mage in the game, mind you. That would be a local necromancer girl, Jade. Uh, the only benefit Biala has is she. Can cast cleric spells, I guess, if you really need to. And yeah, the reason why I have the caveat of being able to hire companions uh, for non-combat stuff is this, for the scrolls, and because we would not be able to open the chest where the long sword, well, arming sword, we need, uh, is uh, um, otherwise, so... That's the reason. If you insist. So yeah, uh, Biala wants into the library, we do too. Let's help each insist. other. I would prefer if we could enlist without her. Wait. Uh, what does she want? Yes. Speak your mind on the move. Hmm. Do I actually need? Uh... If you insist. Yes. Hmm. It used to be a simple talk with her, but apparently not anymore. Speak on the move. I guess we need to do the Maybe we need to become noble first.
which is not a big deal. Can do that. If you insist. Uh. Yes. Speak your mind. I guess we part I'm ways always then. Ready. Don't you have on the move? I guess I misremembered about her quest. Uh, let's do the Aspen stuff then first. If you insist, let me in. Yeah, I've got the quest to find path. Mm. Now we'll have to wait until daytime. Uh, oh. And I believe it's that embassy. If you insist. Yes. Very well. That's the noble we gave bla if bracelet for free to. And now he will get us papers to get inside. With the king. And that we do. If you insist. And yeah, now we will do the same to grab the scrolls we are missing, or really any scrolls, to be fair. Well, if identification scrolls they can keep, I don't care. I mean, they are rather costly, but it's more effort than it's worth. We can do identification ourselves, I believe I even slotted like one or two of those. Yeah. If you insist. You are not using it anyway. Speak your mind. Oh, what's that? On the move. That's a spell weaver only? Huh. What does it do? Oh, just wake from sleep. So not useful at all. Unless they've added some enemies that sleep you in mass, but I highly if doubt it. Insist.
and now with a bit of bureaucracy Asks us to find his if you like, papers or whatever. to find and here is the ritual whatever for the noble dude nothing here some stuff here One reputation. If you it's whatever. Insist. I mean, we can take a bit of rudeness. We are not petty. If you insist. Yeah, ID scroll they can keep, I don't care. 20 gold. Ah, uh, there was a, hmm, a scroll somewhere. And yeah, that. Yoink. Ah, uh, they're still not mad at us, so we can yoink another. Okay, still not mad. All right. Yeah, we are still good. Same with that. Uh, let's see. Now that we truly don't care about. So I guess that would be it for the area. I oh, guess so. They can have their petty coin. If you insist. Give the alms or whatever. So uh, to the Espen estate we go. But first, let's scribe everything. Sword by type. Can we scribe any of that? We should have most of that, if not everything. Yep. actually sure this is useful to us. I guess for the dodge kinda it's useful-ish. Mm. 
Oh, think on it. Well, healing and if you rest here uh, you will have pretty strong mercenaries to sp uh, spawn and they are a good source of experience and very expensive loot if you are ever struggling Espen estate courtyard is the best resting farm You can generate like many, many thousands in the span of like 15 minutes. If you insist, look into my eyes as you perish. <laughs> And I am hot swapping my weapon sets in case you haven't noticed. So I attack with a two-hander and defend with a shield. Not a hundred percent guaranteed, but I mean, probably saves me a bit of damage here and there. Blood cells.
ice. And the last one. I do your bidding this time. Well, I mean, it's not like the last last. Hello, Manticore. I'll cut you into little pieces. There we go. Uh, let's do the block and accuracy thing. Now buried twice. Yes, I know. Come on. There we go. Uh, oh, mine maze. Mm, probably not. Not for us. Well, I guess we'll just murder them for now. Here are the papers we were after. Yes, I know. There we go. I uh, don't believe there is anything of interest out here. Oh, except for more scorpions, obviously. Surrounded by curse. Okay, that one is also dead. Decently healed now. I believe that would be all. Except there, for the ghost. Friendly face at last. Please, it was all down to Aldnar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The last time I saw her, I was about to leave with you, Will. Yeah, so uh, we promise her to find a trinket. It will be like a family story of. Two sisters who didn't see eye to eye and never reconciled before one of them dead. I mean, it's a story as old as time. Guess it's touching or something. Mm. 
Yes. Oh, speaking of Kingmaker, should I replay it again? I wonder. It's been like half a year since I touched that. Well, that's a good thing, although I'm pretty sure I was pretty rough at Kingmaker at the point of that run. Although, I mean, it wasn't all that horrible, was it? Apart from Act 1, that one was sloppy as hell. Yeah, sure. That's gonna happen. Uh, not. Varn with, like, default mercs. Yeah. No. <laughs> probably not. I mean, it's probably doable. It will take uh, such an ungodly amount of rerolls, though. Especially in the end game, where you are left by your lonesome. But yeah, King, uh, Kingmaker with Companions is actually cozy, I mean. The only companion you really, really need, uh, well, even that not really, it just makes life so much easier, is a cleric, because traditionally all cats for some reason hate clerics. On the moon. Beats me why. If you insist. Hey, record keeper. Yep, we are invited into the castle now. Uh, no. Uh, Val is actually the strongest companion in the game. Like, no cap. Even early. She is way too good. Her and Juby Lost pretty much can carry any party by their own. That's just a fact. And Val can do so many things well. I mean, she can do uh, melee sorcerer, she can do melee bard, she can do tanky bard. Pick your poison. Ah, it's you. The reports I have read recommended you be elevated from the... Co So, uh, his majesty pretty much robs us blind, he's affected by the greed curse. We'll fix him. Dis if you insist. Can I help you?
Well, Can I, I mean... help you? Even before she gets her bonus stats, I mean, 14 in strength is not, like, horrible. I mean, compared to the perfect allocation that's, like, minus 3, uh, most of the time you can live with a minus 3, it's 15% uh, to hit all in all. I mean, it's not all that bad. And her constitution is high enough that she can often take not one, but like two hits before she goes down, which is very much important. So no, I say that is awesome. I mean, the only way she could have been better if that one fighter uh, would have been one monk. Outside of that, you can do so much with her. If you insist. And if Oak is not contested, it's even not a big deal. I mean... Kingmaker doesn't really have ins insane stat requirements. Most everything is kind of good enough for it. It's not Roth where everything is percentage based. So, end game enemies tend to be kinda insane. But in Kingmaker, it's linear difficulty, so, so long as you outgrow initial hurdles. Like, the early game in Kingmaker is fucking horrendous compared to Roth. But you just suffer through, get experience, get some levels. Cover the deposit and you're fine from there. If you insist. Like, you don't need a billion stats, like, eh, whatever. And with that in mind, Val is perfectly adequate to do pretty much anything you need her to do. In fact, Reg has higher combat stats, but he is worse uh, because he has one level in Magus. Speak yes. your mind. I'm old. Uh, yes. Are you ready to, to talk with me now? Not yet. I'll make it. What if we move a bit? Are you ready to talk now? Yes. Yep, there we go. Yep, Speak let's get the book. There we go. So yeah, indeed, we need to do the Espen Estate. Uh, although I'm not sure, maybe I've missed the dialogue option previously. Uh, one way or another, we'll get our library access. And that would net a spark and maybe something else, I'm not sure. Maybe there is something fancy. Yeah, 
I played it on release. Uh, not since then, I don't have it. I use the Xbox Pass to get it. I've played through it and didn't touch it ever since, and I don't have it in my library. And at the moment, uh, buying games is so uh, much of a headache in Russia. So I don't do that. Basically, getting your money into Steam, yeah, it's horrendous. So many hoops you have to jump through. Awful that. Basically, Steam doesn't want my money and uh, GOG doesn't want my money either. If you insist. A plus on the release, it was outrageous. It was like 40 bucks or something. Uh, let me check if it's on sale. I might grab it. Uh, Wasteland 3. Uh, is it still Epic exclusive? I mean, I, at least I can't... Uh, ah, right. It's blocked for my region. That's amazing. Oh, here is your answer then. Uh, let me look at the Epic Store. Yep, can't buy it. There you go. Speak your mind on the move. Mental. I mean, I might find the key uh, to buy, but we'll see. Uh, no, it was not Russia who uh, blocked it, it's the other way. Uh, the publisher decided to remove it uh, for Russians. I don't believe Russia banned pretty much, hmm, well, much of anything in terms of content. There was that, uh, uh, what it was, it was like one Call of Duty game from what I remember and that was pretty much it. But that was ages ago. I do your bit. All right, he Mr. wants us to remove rats from the cellar. If you insist. We'll do just that. Easy as pie. If you insist, get the rings. Uh, oh. Uh, not from the cellar. Ah, oh, no, no, no. Here they are. Uh, yes. Hello. Yeah, I've talked to the rats.
here's the solution. And our solution is to send them to the kitchen. I mean, we were asked to remove them from the cellar. That we if did. You insist. Technically correct is the best sort of correct. If you insist. There we go. Not in the cellar. Professor Mandelroth, I humbly apologize for the unwitting part I played in the demise of Aldabarth, the greatest goat to ever graze the green fields of Yarengal. So there we go, we reconciled Biala with the idiot professor dude, got access to the library. If you insist. And now we can rob it blind. Oh. Uh, should have used the stairs. That would have a much, much shorter load. Oh, silly me. And the memory leak strikes again. I mean, it will become worse as the game progresses, including loading times. It's Unity game stuff. Ain't nothing we can do about it. At least for unmodified Unity. Uh, for Roth, uh, all cats pretty much rebuilt it from the ground up and then rebuilt it some more. Which is why Roth is so much better than Kingmaker on the technical side. Like the loading times are 10 times better for sure. If you insist, I really, really wish they would port. Um, Kingmaker on the Roth engine. But fat, fat chance of that. Although I would really appreciate it. I would even buy the game again. So yeah, as to Wasteland 3, outside of me finding the keys somewhere, that will not happen. If you insist. I'm reasonably sure even the gifts won't work. At least not before the whole debacle is over. If you insist. One way or the other. I mean, I'm not sure how game sales affect uh, government policy, but hey. If you insist. I mean, unless hmm, Putin is like secretly an avid gamer. If you insist. Hmm. 
Up here is the book. Yes. Yeah, talk to Biala. Acquiring trials of the White Elves was the first step. Yep. I'll make uh, it. Do whatever you want. I'm always ready. Talk. Part ways for a while. See ya. We gained what we wanted from it. Namely, the sparkle spell. There we go. We can now remove all that trash. And get some sparkles in. That's it. Ah, oh, right, right, right. Uh, I wanted to buy the glacial Hello. whatevers. And some other stuffs. I want... Gale Shroud. That one. Awesome. So, don't need that. go ah uh, what <laughs> all right I'll click through again come on game Can also go acquiring that links that yes yes oh wait ah come on I'll have to mm -hmm. redo it by type There we go, and now we can sell the rest. I blame the king. Okay, let's do it again this time. Actually, correctly. Expensive summon spells can go. Any other expensive scrolls that I, I can get rid of. Now, uh, let's get bottomless bag, because why not?
How does it actually work? Open. Aha. Uh -huh. So... It's like... What? 20 slots? Guess it's nice. Uh, do you have... Hello? Crow container? By any chance, uh, doesn't look like it, unless I'm blind. Well, at least I don't see it, so it's probably not here. Anyway, uh, let's go to the second floor. Floor, I believe. Or is it here? No, 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 that's library. If you insist. Yes. Hey yo, here it is. quest so now he wants bark right ah no 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 he wants a billion potions oh tough shit you are not getting those most likely if you insist because i am sure not cooking those At least, I don't believe I will. We'll see, though. So that part of the deal is over. If you insist. I guess we technically can go do Hamlin's quest. Although I don't particularly care about that one. So I probably will ignore it. Oh, by the way, if someone wants to add me uh, on Steam or whatnot, uh, please do tell in the uh, chat so I do know. Although I am reasonably certain that Eisenfear is the same. But yeah, it's best you notify me on Discord if you want to add me on Steam. Otherwise, I do tend to ignore requests, because who knows? So, where to next? I need... Well, let's go to the Market Street. I will guess I will grab companions just in case I want to do something with them. So I do have them. I'm not sure they remain there after we are done with all the quest dealies. I mean, I know the ones that are on neutral locations remain, but the ones in town I'm not so certain. I guess I can leave Hamlin behind. Uh, we have another Thiefy Rogue type. So we can test it with Hamlin. 
If you insist. Although, I mean, I would prefer to have this saved to test stuff. Uh, yeah, I'll probably collect I all the companions. Wish to be on my way. Call me Soraka, please. Unfortunately, yes, business of a kind. They're here on behalf of their master, Elenuator. Not all, Rillo, no. I no longer answer to Elenuator. I've turned to the light of Alenarius. To him I pray now. And to him I have consecrated my faith. Elenuator has reacted badly to my decision. On the move. <laughs> Look at this. <laughs> Letter. And the next will soon to follow. Well, I guess if we are all like shit, which we obviously did. Yeah, they were wrong to question my faith. Go yes, ahead. welcome to the party, yes. and goodbye. I do your bidding this time. Um, anything you? new on that trailer? Well, they've added throwing knives here. Let's buy all of them since we are leveling throwing. Might as well. Drop like three there. The rest will go into our horde because, of course, they will. Uh, let's keep time the day there we go uh, yes I know let's make sure Greetings. we've bought everything we needed to hmm? yes your wares Potion case, uh, yoink. Uh, anything we want from that? Uh, we need infusion of tears, infusion of natural resistance, strong potion, and two potions of constitution. I don't believe do we had any of those. Nope. If you insist. Well, at least we bought a potion case. I mean, it's marginally useful. Bizarre. If you insist. Yes, that's nice. Uh, do you sell any containers? If you insist. Yes. Nope. Uh, there has to be a container uh, sold on a witch. Uh, I wonder if which one insist. is it, scrolls or components. 
I know we can basically rob the dwarven lady blind. Oh, well, ah, no, 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 she is not dwarf. Uh, well, basically herbalist, herbalist, uh, whatever. Yes. In the Moonblade or whatever that area is called. Balanced knife, one to four. I believe it's worse than poison blades we have. Yeah, way worse. And he sells nothing of interest to us. We've already bought the part we were interested in. Insist. If you insist. So I guess uh, let's go in Hamlin because I need him uh, for the testing purposes for later. Well, for when I'm done with the game. If you insist. This is... What is your wish? Speak you on the move. Shady task. Ah, oh, yeah. Uh, he wants a painting from the estate. I wonder if that quest actually leads anywhere now. If you insist. Hello. Hello, old lady. What do you have for me? Any containers, maybe? No. Oh, that panda, I guess. Hmm? Off I go. What is your wish? I'll teach you brewing and drawing, and I guess lock picking first. Ah, actually, pickpocketing first. that for sure. Uh, let's get it to 50%, that should be enough for now. Granted, he is almost max level. Because rogues have the fastest progression out of all. No, 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 not still unplanned. Pick locks. Mm. 
Normally you are probably going the other way with the weapons. You want both first and small weapons for a change. There we go. Uh, lock picking is maxed out. Enough been stealing, hide and sneak, I mean, could do that, but no, ain't nobody cares. Trap disarming, same deal. That's not where the experience is. Eh, I guess. I believe Hide and Sneak does increase backstab damage. So, if we... well, if I ever use him for anything, that will do. Kinda lost track where he is leveling wise. Uh, don't believe he has the well enough experience to per level for 20, so that's 40 total, so we have 10 left. So, yeah, not enough for anything else. I guess I'll drop it into throwing for the role playing purposes. Got one of that, two of that. Malicious strike, I don't believe in. Although it's probably not a question of faith, in all fairness. So here we again have 40 total, eh, I guess. I can invest the remainder into stealing and planting or disarming traps. I guess we can, because why not? Speak your mind. So there we go. All that good enough. A beer would be nice. Yes. There we go, still in the blood form Don't you I stone, so we can this time. I'll re gift it to the other quest giver. If you insist. So that's nice. Go to the Espen estate, give him a painting. But that will happen tomorrow, as I really have to run. It's late here.
So I will see you tomorrow at around 12 Moscow time. Have a good day, night, evening, what have you. Have a good time. See you tomorrow. Peace. И русским зрителям до свидания. Всего хорошего. Извините, завтра не 12 по Москве. Всем пока. Спасибо за рыбу. До свидания. And let's find someone to raid. Who's streaming? Oh, I believe Rogan is streaming. Uh, let me refresh. And send you there if he is actually streaming. Yep. Doom, doom, doom. Ah, uh, what? Why are you unrated? Uh, gotta love Twitch sometimes. Well, anyway, see you tomorrow.